Yeah, I, yeah. When it comes to like South rap, like his era, Ti, David Banner. That that's the, like my favorite. <laughs> Bro, me and Young Jeezy. Bro, I feel like the last couple of times me and Nance have played basketball, we've kind of been just like going through blog era. Oh, okay, um, yeah. Right, okay, yeah. Blog era shit, mm -hmm. just in South. Yeah. Everything, and like that blog era trap shit was crazy too. Crazy. Because even the commercialized version of it, which was, uh, we'll say commercialized version, but uh, B.O.B. Oh, uh, yeah. B.O.B. Yeah, had, yeah, had crazy B.O.B. had crazy hits. Yeah, yeah. He did, he did. But even his like mixtapes and shit before his that, like, I only had crazy. one, but yeah, that's how I found him. Yeah, I remember the mixtape that I had, it was like white, black, and green mm. was the cover. Oh, was, uh, and oh, some man, of the skits, the skits, one of the skits on there that I vividly remember was a nigga who's like a junkie, but you can buy pussy. <laughs> so he's like at the store and he's like, come on, man, let me just... Come on, man. Let me get some of that pussy behind the counter, man. You know what I'm saying? Hey, I got I only got five on me, man. Hook, hook, hook me up with something. It was please. Yeah, it was some wild sketch like that. Yeah, please tell me that y'all have heard this his Bob song called N Nigger. I have. Yes. Yeah. I was, holy that, shit, that, that was huge. Kind of I, I, he's that. I forgot nigger. about that. I he's think I heard that song. Play That's that. What shit. I, oh my god! <laughs> I couldn't believe it when I, I was forgot, hearing it. I forgot that came out. Holy shit! Yeah. yeah, it was on one of his mixtapes. Yeah, right yeah. there on the second one. Good. Oh, Good yeah. Oh, no, it's not that one. Yeah, go to the second one. Yeah, yeah, it's the second one right there. I <laughs> oh, my God. I That's forgot what I, about that. <laughs> I forgot. Yeah, that, that would be That's your favorite song right there. All day. All day. That would yeah. be his yeah. yeah. shit. <laughs> Cause what yeah, was it's that, tongue in cheek. What know? was that uh, Trinidad James shit? I'm from the south side of the city. Yeah. Yeah. Niggas ain't fucking with me. Oh, I thought you were talking about uh, gold all the mouth. It was south side. South side. Yeah, that's, south side. that's the only one. I heard. Yeah. Can you turn the volume up on the uh, screen too, or uh -huh. you know, on the <coughs> oh, you can do that too. South side, yeah. This was crazy. Who were the features? That album was crazy. Forty Bowie. Forty Bowie oh, had a little run. Mm. He did. Yeah. It's at first. I one. felt like he had a run on the features. Oh, you know. It was. I, it was <laughs> yeah, yeah. Okay, that, that whole album. Yeah, was I never heard that. Fire. That album was crazy, but that verse is an iconic verse. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. It like that, I was that he ask has you that. he better be a legend in his city for that song. Oh yeah, for the, the for, for that verse. Yeah, no, yeah, because I was gonna ask you like, is he considered like a, a one hit wonder like designer or yes. or did he have oh he is okay. he's a one hit wonder he is oh, but yeah, yeah. he's a one album because that's the sure. only song I really heard that was big of his was the, you know, the, the uh, gold on gold, my gold on yeah, my yeah, chain yeah yeah that was the only one I heard. But he was con he continued to make good music afterwards. Yeah, yeah. But it was crazy. So like he blew up, mm -hmm. and then he dropped this project. This project went crazy because it had that song on it. Okay. And then on his next album, it was either he maybe he put his first album out, but on his sophomore album, okay. he pretty much stopped doing the album. Was like, hey man, I can't put the album out, and I can't pay anybody for the features. Like I got oh, dropped. Oh shit. So like. There was like a hard stop to the music career, oh, that's not but like good. he so was he, transparent about it though. You know, like yeah. straight up said, "What happened? I got dropped. I don't have the money to pay y'all. I can't release it." Yeah. Mm -hmm. So he's not a musician right now. He's not a rapper. I think he does music still, mm -hmm. but very sparingly. Yeah. Okay. Because he had, he ended up having a media career after that. He became a media personality. He had a show with Complex for a couple of years. Oh. A uh, sneaker show. He became like um, before he popped off with that song. He had already owned, I think, some sort of like a boutique yeah. in Atlanta oh, or something. Okay. Okay. So he just doubled back down into his okay. fashion. Yeah. And uh, he had a show with Complex, and it was on for a while, if it's not still on. Yeah. On Designing his own. He had like a two chains kind of deal. Complex, yup. Trinidad Jane Breaks Down Designer, his own sneaker, the Complex Sneaker Podcast. So, so yeah, if eBay. this is, scroll down, when did this drop? Uh, two years ago. Two years ago. Yeah. But uh, search the. The complex, complex sneaker, sneaker pod. pod. Yeah, 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 just the clip itself. Complex sneaker pod. Yeah, just to see if they've uploaded recently. Mm -hmm. It looks like he's not on it. That was uploaded yeah. yesterday. Click that. Yeah. He's on that. So maybe it's rotating host. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay, that nigga does those videos where he be in the store shopping with the people. Oh, yeah, okay. Yeah, I've seen those. That, yeah, 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 yeah. Everybody got one of those videos. Yeah. Okay, so Trinidad James not on it no more, or maybe they rotate the host because it was a similar room to this. Oh, so he was just, like he just did many episodes sitting with them. Maybe he was hired uh -huh. for a season or two or something like that. Yeah. I don't oh, know because he was on there for a while. It wasn't like a one time appearance. Yeah, actually, so he wasn't Johnson. just a guest or yeah. something. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay, because they definitely have guests as you can see. Yeah, yeah. Action Johnson, Fat Joe. Yeah. 
Do you guys watch this regularly? Mm-mm. No, I don't watch no, it don't at all. Yeah, I'm not into sneakers like that. You know mm-hmm. what I'm saying? To where I'll be watching a show about them. But that's just pretty much long story short for yeah. Trinidad James, though. Yeah. What happens if you're like, you get onto one of those episodes? I used to think, like, what if I was on one of those episodes? Yeah. Like, yeah, sneakers. What kind of sneakers? I'm like, I, I, I don't know, man. Like, yeah. it wouldn't be good content. <laughs> no, it wouldn't. Yeah. yeah, it would be. <laughs> you have to really know your. Yeah. Well, yeah. honestly, those, even those buy your sneakers videos that we'd be seeing on Complex. Yeah. They're either good because the person's really into sneakers or they don't know nothing. And then they look at the sneaker and be like, $2,000? You know what I'm saying? Like, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Like that they're shocked happen. at, you yeah, know, that's right. the average person. Yeah. But they're like, well, let me just get some of those Jordan ones because that, <laughs> that looks like something I could wear with everything. Like, they're just, we keep it simple. Yeah, the prices like, do be startling niggas sometimes. <clears throat> oh, it's crazy. You see sticker yeah. shock and shit. You know what it kind of reminds me of? It's like modern antique roadshow. Oh, yeah. Antique Road. Yeah, yeah. 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 Antique Road Show was crazy. Yeah, I used was. to watch that shit. It was Man, like QVC. I don't QVC. know what y'all talking about. Mm-hmm. It's like a, it was it? like a TV show. It was like a TV mm-hmm. show. But they also had like a network at yeah, certain Yeah, they have people times. walking around or something like yeah, that while they're doing their shit. Yeah, people walking around and people have antiques. Yeah. They played around the clock on, mm-hmm. on, on some channel. And, and the like, host yeah. would go around and like give the history on the items and stuff yeah. like that. Oh, word. You yeah. Just, you bring random shit from your house. Right, And people, they appraise it for you. The only one I remember is somebody. Oh, that's kind of fire. Yeah, somebody had like an ancient like compass or something like that right. he was telling me it was like from like the 1800s or something. yeah shit. because like the whole thing is like the also like the high of the show or one of the highs of the shows is like somebody had some valuable shit and they didn't know they didn't know oh. you know what so i'm saying oh, i think i might know you. what y'all talking about so yeah. it's like that nick, yeah. somebody bring the rug that, that they grandma yes yeah. yeah. right left in the back room or whatever and they're like this is a one-on-one quilt that like George, that George, George Washington's yeah, wife. Yeah, George Washington yeah. owned this shit. Yeah. It's, an art, it's an artifact, okay? Yeah, yeah. 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 So it's like, you might need to submit this to a And man. you're rubbing your feet all over it and shit. Yeah, you just <laughs> throwing it in the washing machine. And yeah. So yeah, every so often you get those moments where- Y'all think y'all got any items at the crib like that? No, but I've been t- talking to my brother about- nah. yeah, No, 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 just selling our like NES shit for like thousands of dollars because he's is it going on, for thousands now? Is something, yeah. Uh, I got sent or hundreds yeah. at least. No, it could be up there too oh, in true. the thousands. Yeah, and oh, we have shit. like a bunch. So I don't know if we're just sitting on money. You know, uh, probably are. And just keeping it for nostalgia. Matter of fact, I got a Super Nintendo with a shit ton of games. So. Uh, hold yeah. on, hold on now. A lot yeah. of them games came from your boy. I yeah, just, oh no, I was just oh, looking really? for some. Oh, yeah, okay, yeah, okay, okay, yeah. okay. <laughs> it's like there was something just I know we have a whole crate. We can split. We yeah, literally have, have to split. Yeah, we literally have a whole crate full of games. Yeah, we do. Some of them games might be $40, $50. No, that's not a fact. Real. And it's, it's like fact. 60 in there. Yeah, yeah. we got a bunch yeah, of games. It's a lot. It's a lot. We combined our stash. We got to be. Yeah, Because we both put them all in one crate. So niggas got some shit in there. I know. I know Killer Instinct mm. is going. Yeah, because like, that's got to go. Yeah, that's like Killer something. Instinct. Yeah, Killer Instinct is one of them games. That's There's probably, a high demand for people that just want to play that shit. Mm. Yeah, right. let alone collect it. Yeah, that's the only. That's the. That's the only game you put my ass at. Yeah, I, <laughs> yeah. That's they the one. It? That's the one fighting game that I fell in love with. Yeah. Outside of that fighting, the next one was like Tekken two or three. Mm-hmm. Three for sure for me. I think because was two or three was that PlayStation two? Yeah, three was I can't PlayStation remember. one. PlayStation one, I believe. I think Tekken three was three was PlayStation two. Mm. Okay, so I'm thinking of three because okay. I remember I played it yeah. on the Tekken, PlayStation three. I think it was PS two. PlayStation yeah. three. Mm. It was three. The one I'm thinking about the one that I played on PlayStation three. Oh, okay. Oh, sorry. PlayStation three. Sorry, sorry. sorry. Uh, PlayStation two. PlayStation Tekken two. Tekken three. PlayStation two. Oh, that, that one. That one with the yeah. That okay. one with Jen on the cover. I think. Mm. Yeah. That might yeah have been a, that's the first one actually. Yeah. Hold on. That's the first one. Uh, but down here it does say Tekken three fighting game. 97. Yeah, the arcade version of it was released 2000. Yeah. Oh, oh history, but but it did come out on PS1 first. It looks like. Okay. Mm. Hmm. Any y'all getting um, Soul Calibur 2? I played oh, a little bit of Soul, like Soul Calibur. I like yeah. Soul Calibur. Yeah. I did like Soul. Calibur. I used to play Soul Calibur. Definitely. Now you know what I used to go crazy with? Mm. Power Stone, nigga. Yeah, Power Stone. Power Stone too. Never heard of it. What is that? Put look 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 that up on uh, YouTube. Power Stone. Yeah. So you can so you can see the oh Dream Dreamcast. Oh my God! Yeah, I, never had one. I never had a Dreamcast. I, only, I got one in the crib. Nice. We only have one game for a Dreamcast, and it's still functional. That's crazy. Oh, it's hell. I got Crazy Taxi too. Oh shit! It's crazy like, Taxi is a great game. This is like, this is like Smash Brothers kind of. Oh, okay. It's like Smash Brothers, yeah, but that's hard. Oh, it's way ahead of its time, fire. man. It's nigga, crazy. This fire, shit, nigga. This shit is crazy. Yeah. yeah, this is but you can go back and forth between the two. One of those ships is gonna fall into the ground at some point. Mm. I'm not gonna lie, this start level, like blinking or something to let you this, know. This looks like a terrible level, though. Yeah, I would hate nah, this. Level. Nah, this was fun as hell. Yeah, it's a good level. Fun. This was straight. Oh, yeah, yeah. Swimming oh you too. can swim. Okay, if you, <laughs> yeah, you can swim. Too. Okay, all right, you just changed it up. You can swim. Then you got the ice. 
blocks. Oh, you, you know, in Smash, this is crazy. Getting in the water would be an instant death. Oh, but this yeah, is like fun dying. right now, dog. Awesome. <laughs> Just game, watching it. <laughs> this game is the yeah. shit, bro. I would play this today. Yo, yeah. For, yeah. yo, yeah. player <laughs> one's power right now. He is like shit is OP, dude. Yeah, he goes <laughs> crazy. crazy. Oh yeah, he's, he's fucking, fucking niggas, niggas up. up. Yeah. Oh, so you can just spam that shit. You just keep doing it. Uh, you gotta, you gotta get your gems. Yeah, whatever uh, stone that has. You gotta get your three gems. I think. I think it's three gems. Oh, that's that's a, crazy. That's the so how old, old little, were you? Because Dreamcast was like ninety nine, two thousand. It so was, but I got it late. So you I got it late. Yeah, oh, okay. I didn't. I didn't get a Dreamcast like when it first came out. Okay. My cousin had it though. Okay. And that was where I saw and played Power Stone for the first time in Philly. Yeah. Over in Germantown at his house okay. and <laughs> I was, I grew, in Germantown. It's okay. like this. A lot of people live in Germantown. Okay. But uh, okay. <clears throat> long story short, uh. Yeah, that's where I got the bug for it. And then, like, I got a Dreamcast in high school, maybe. Okay. Like, so just a couple, a it's already, it's later. out of date. Yeah, 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 yeah it's I mean, out of date. To yeah. where I was able to get it for, like, a hundred bucks or something. You yeah. know, like, oh, okay. yeah, yeah, you know, yeah, yeah, you know, yeah. you know, that, you know that moment when mm -hmm. it's, like, it's old and you can get a used one for cheap. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Buy a used one and then you can get games for the low. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, I did the same thing. That's the only reason I didn't get into it, because by the time I got it, it was so late. You yeah. know, it came you know and went. You know, yeah. it was like the, it was, it it was like the Zoom. Forever. You know, yeah. you remember the Zoom? Yeah, oh yeah, I remember the Zoom. Yeah, I, I had Zoom. one, bro. I had one too. Yeah, Zoom. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that yeah, was like yeah, I couldn't Zoom. get an iPod, so they yeah, got yeah. the Zoom. It yeah, was like iPod. Windows iPod. You yeah, know, it was like yeah. their their MP3 player. I definitely uh -huh. remember the Zoom. I, I almost got one. I had a Zoom. Big big square shit. Yeah, it was big. Yeah, yeah, it was like a phone. Cause I was gonna yeah, get yeah, the yeah, two. Yeah. I think I was gonna get like the two or the three, and then oh, I, I, I decided against. Yeah, it. I had a. Uh, yeah, I don't it know. Fell off right it. after that. Yeah, but mine was black. I remember the commercial place. for this. Yeah. 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 Wasn't it people like dancing? Yeah, and it was like black silhouettes. I think. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. With colorful backgrounds. Yep. Yeah. Every square had a yeah, different that was color. Mm -hmm. And that shit. Because like, they sold them in every color. Yeah, right. yeah, they did. Oh, they had, they okay. had so many oh, colors. Oh, damn, I thought they all had of them a shit ton of colors. Yeah, yeah. the color game. Like okay. the early ones were, but this was yeah. like the big commercialized one. Yeah, that yeah. middle one is what yeah. I had. Yeah. Yeah, me too. Well, I, I might have had the smaller version, but yeah, I had You it. know what? I, but I will say that that shit was underrated, though. No, like, for sure. I, it had a short <laughs> life in terms of popularity, yeah. but that shit was fucking functional. I, I kind of like it better than the MP3 player I have now. It was perfect. Mm, and, yeah. and especially because back in them days, you can get your LimeWire shit and put it on that Zoom. Yes. It had apps. You could run apps on it. Yeah, for sure. Yo, okay, here's crazy. It had a. It came with a little gel skin on it automatically. Yes, like a, like it a did. Little, it did. Little, uh, but that was when that through. was when the Protected. that was when the, the the companies were like they cared. Oh, actually, what, thinking about yeah. you. Yeah, when they wanted to give you a quality product, they're like, <laughs> let me go ahead and give you a half protection <laughs> yeah, now. <right. laughs> but now they're like, Not nah, nigga, that case fifty dollars. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Otherwise, your shit is naked. Yeah, yeah. and yeah. you're not getting headphones. You got to buy them too. That's, For sure. That's another forty. Yeah. Like they're nickel and dime. Oh, you shit out of That's a good point. It used to just come with a set of headphones. That was a smack in the face. There was a tweet that just went viral, and it was the inside of an old iPhone box and all the iPhones used to come with a charging block, the charging cable, mm -hmm. headphones and headphones. Like yeah. of like of the everything you need. Yeah. Everything but a case. Wait, wait so it doesn't now? No, like, now I remember, I'm, I'm the nigga, now. it doesn't even come with the charging block. Yeah, no it doesn't come all you get now. is the cord. cord. Yeah. Just come what? Cord. Yes. Yeah. All you get is the cord and you have to buy no, your block. Yeah. You do. You definitely do. What the? Fuck? Yeah. 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 And definitely no headphones. They they yeah. cut that. They cut that, that out. That was the first to go. Correct. And then the the block is something that's like the last two years. And oh, they just shit. and they just switched back over to the Samsung style charger for some reason. Yeah. The now it's the uh, it's the universal the, Thunderbolt ones. thing now. Yeah. Which I ain't gonna lie, I ain't mad at it. Me and Brenda J was talking about Thunderbolts for like five ten minutes last night. <laughs> yeah. It's better. I was like, nigga, Thunderbolts are yeah. <laughs> fuck a USB. What is that? Yeah, yeah. Like, yeah. you know what I'm saying? Just like, what, the wall. what is a USB, nigga? Give yeah. me that Thunderbolt, nigga. Yeah. Like fast fuck, charge, yeah. like that. And yeah. it charges. It tr transfer data. Every time I put my yeah phone in the wall versus the computer. The computer takes forever. Yeah, bro. It's it's crazy. That USB is dead, yeah. bro. That's all we had at one point. Yeah, but go, going back to the video game. Oh, wait. Damn, we didn't even open it. Up. Oh, we didn't. Shit. Yeah, we didn't even open it. Up. You can count on it. You can count on it. You can count on me. You can count on me, too. You can count on it. You can count on it. You can count on me. You can count on me, too. You can count on it. You can count on it. You can count on me. You can count on me too. You can count on it. You can count on it. You can count on me. You can count on me too. Fuck it. Welcome. 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 <laughs> to the 3 Podcast, where even the artists can be fans. AJ the Menace. Shane M. Petty. And your boy Jeff. White man's on the boards. Yeah. Florida Mac is on the boards. That's me. 
And we are back with another week. You know, yeah. uh, it, we, this is all going to be, we ain't got no topics, niggas, but you're going to see our excellence. Yeah. <laughs> but, yeah, 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 yeah. but we were having fun. We just about to jump it up. But I mean, look, I mean, to be I'll fair, we, we were talking about shit we love, though. Yeah, exactly. Hey. Um, <laughs> But yeah, you know, my brother's in town as well, too. Yeah. Brandon is in the building, you know what I'm saying? He's in the back. Y'all can't hear him. I'm, we might get him a mic at some point, probably. Yeah, yeah, if you have something to say. Yeah, if you, you got something to say, just something. maybe wire him one just yeah, so he we'll can have it. For sure. But um, yeah, man, what were you saying? Yeah, about I was going to say, like, the game that me and my brother really got into, because, you know, I don't know how, how it was going to be chopped in the beginning, but we were just talking about, like, video games and shit. Oh, I'm, it's all going to be there. Oh, okay, cool. It's all going to be there, um, yeah. Yeah, I was, the one that we really got into was the Silent Hill games yeah what's yeah. that sound from me yeah, it was kind of like that picture yeah it was like resident cover? evil's brother so right yeah right yeah. i remember this Those. i remember this but yeah, you have no gun though. You, without a gun you have no gun right or something like no that. no you, you do um oh. but but it was like to me yeah, it was I just about this. it was kind of scarier it was kind of freakier than than the resident evil games uh, the, the atmosphere because it was all clouds and that shit. that company right there in that bottom right corner konami oh you remember seeing that shit all right Mm -hmm. Nami wasn't playing games with niggas oh, back they in the day. They made Metal Gear. They, they, made, Metal Gear. Gear. they yeah. made Metal Gear. Yeah, yeah bro. Yeah. That shit was, yeah. that logo was like, I was like, all right. And that was we're the yeah. we in for some shit. <laughs> You're in for some shit. Yeah, bro. And this, those games, they made adult games. Yes. Some of these, yeah. Yeah. Some of these games really, kids shouldn't be, like Metal Gear Solid, you need to be like 17 to play. It for really, real. A lot 16 of the games. 16 max. Like, or else you're just not going to understand the game. Yeah, me trying to play it at 9, 10, I did not, I couldn't. I couldn't grasp the concept. Of I that got shit. into it though. That first one was fire. Yeah, yeah. I still got yeah. into it, but it's mm -hmm. it was like fuck. This is hard. You mean yeah. the oh, first? Yeah. You mean the one on PS2? On PS1. PS1. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, that four disc version, nigga, or yeah. two disc, whatever it was. The solid, yeah. solid Snake. Or? Yeah. yeah. Oh yeah, it was four. It was four. It was four. That's four, right. Yeah. yeah. It was yeah. Four. Yep. yep. I had thick that. ass case, yep. nigga. Uh, yep. Yeah. You guys know they have a remaster for all the games now. Uh, for yeah, for Resident Evil, I know. Oh, for Metal Gear. Yeah. Oh shit. No, I didn't know that. No, I didn't know that, but I didn't um. I don't think I played that many like remastered games. The only the only remastered game that I've ever played was Dragon's Dogma. Mm. Because ah, on yeah. that, they remastered that and I played that one again. Mm. But I guess maybe I don't love enough video games to play the remastered. I don't know. You you're, you're yeah. kind of a PC gamer though, right? No, nah, oh. system. Oh, okay. System. Yeah, system. Okay. Yeah, and and even like my boy Brian, he showed me the the remake for Resident Evil 2, I believe. Yeah. And I couldn't I guess I maybe I hadn't seen it in a long time, but I couldn't tell the difference. Yeah, but but I mean, it still seemed the same. You know, it's just That's the same thing. It, but yeah, it's the same yeah. thing. It just looks better. Yeah. It's like yeah. it's like it when Disney updated. drops Little Mermaid again. It's oh, oh say, like that remake. They say it's a enhanced, enhanced audio soundtrack. They clean up the colors a little bit. Yeah, you know? better, yeah. better 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 yeah. color clarity. All Full that shit. HD. Full yeah. HD. Yeah. 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 4K now. No, it's not. Nigga. Yeah, no, it's not. Yeah, <laughs> it's a lot cleaner though. Yeah. Yeah. You hit like, a smoothing texture button. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> are, there, are there any video games that you guys would love to see adapted into movies? Ooh. Oh, movies. Hmm. Say it again. Dot hack gu. Dot hack gu. That's but that's a, never. Uh, heard that's of that. already like an anime movie. That's right? an anime thing. Yeah. It, it was a, it's an anime game. Okay. Anime. Oh, dot hack gu. Yeah. Movie form. They got anime movies like when you used to buy the big disc in the back of the day. Mm -hmm. They used to have like three discs with it, and then their movie set to get the backstory. Yeah. Into the game. The, the game video game used to come action. with the DVD with the backstory. Uh, the video game used to come with the DVD to tell you the character's backstory. Oh God, shit! God separately, damn. that I is crazy. That. <laughs> that is crazy. Deep lore. Yeah. Okay, yeah, yeah, that's it. They want you invested in that yeah. shit. Yeah, they're like, let us fill you in real quick before you play it. Yeah. Yeah. They won't even put it in the game. It's just, it's separate. It's, it's not enough shit. space. Yeah, it's not enough space. That's kind of nice, too, because you know back then, cutscenes were such ass cheeks, dude. Oh, They yeah, yeah, were yeah. either good yeah. or bad. Uh, Depends on the game. Who? Final Destination. Oh, Final Destination? Yeah, uh, yeah I, I Final can Destination. Yeah. No, Final Fantasy. Final Fantasy. Final Fantasy. Final Fantasy. Final Fantasy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, they, yeah their cutscenes yeah. were always crazy. Yeah, I will say. Did you... Oh yeah, okay, okay. Yeah, but the original, like, especially like going back to like the original NES games, those backstories. Me and Jerome didn't even used to read them, but it was just like they would have like a still above and then just white words just going by that the you character. had to read, and we never read it. Yeah, same way we that read it. Same way that uh, <laughs> not read it. Kind of like same way that Pokemon game was. Pokemon, right. oh, like yeah. the Pokemon on, oh, on the Nintendo. Yeah, I never used to, yeah, play oh, the Pokemon. You didn't, you didn't I didn't, yeah, we didn't have Pokemon. Mm, okay. we, we didn't get into. Uh, well, not get you didn't into, have, but you didn't the have cartoons. 
Oh man, the cartoon, like the cartoon. Oh, like, you didn't even I didn't even find out about like Pokemon until like late nineties. Gotcha. Okay. Yeah. I mean, the cartoon was cool for a couple seasons or whatever, but mm. right, I was talking the cartoon for the a little bit, lit. but then the, the game, the game, and the cards were lit. Yeah. yeah. So, the wait, were so which one was were first? Like, is it uh, is it based off a video game or, or they just made video games I mean, off of it's this? Probably a comic Maybe. book first. Honestly, I, I have no know. idea. Manga? It was a manga first. Or something? Oh, yeah, something. Know. Pokemon. I, don't I know. thought it was a card game. It's kind of crazy because like this is a question. This is a question. Um. Yeah. My boy Nance would know. Oh shit! Really? If I had to oh. guess, it's probably what you're saying. It's pro- it was probably cards. Yeah. On some antique roadshow, I might have I might have fifteen hundred dollars worth of Pokemon cards. Oh shit! It might be more. It could be more. I have no idea. Oh, I got I got I got a I got a I got a binder, man. Looks like on the you, like, like you first. like it's not like at your mom's house. Like you have them. It's in the car right now. No, I'm just playing. <laughs> The um no, nah. <laughs> so get no, that it's shit. At the crib. It is no, it's at my mom's house. Yeah. Yeah. But yeah. to update you, the pot, I mean, uh, Pokemon, the yeah. video game was first apparently. Okay. Oh shit! Oh, okay. Yeah. Uh, it was um video pocket game pocket first. monsters. Mm-hmm. Okay, video game first, and then maybe um cards because I remember like there were kids in middle when I was in middle school they had the cards. And then, mm. like, but the cartoons were on at the same time, so I yeah. just didn't know which one. It came did first. seem like they were there at the same time. The trading yeah. cards were amazing, bro. That yeah. was they part were of elementary. Because I vividly, <laughs> oh, no, I vividly yeah. remember this moment for well. some reason where we're all. It was like summertime, and like the day camp, we were all at the pool. Yeah. But like during lunch, during the swimming break that we eat and whatever, it just turned into a Pokemon trading frenzy. Yeah. Where <laughs> like all of us that were at the pool during that day summer camp. Yeah. Are just like, nah, nigga. I mean, what you got? Like, we just, <laughs> become a, a open air stock market. market. Yeah, it, be, yeah. it became like a stock market yeah. at the, yeah. at the yeah. pool. Yeah, it was like and Wall Street. Yeah, yeah. it, was like, it got kind of crazy. Oh. Yeah, I vividly remember that moment. You out here day trading in the, on the, in the playground, which I'm is serious. awesome Pokemon card shit. But yeah, these Pokemon cards, Nance is all the way tapped in with it. He has like uh-huh. a Pokemon card page on TikTok and stuff like that. Oh, and damn. Um, yeah, he's going. So he's viral. invested in it. He's invested. He's yeah. fi- he's got like. He's found like rare collectibles or just like done like gifts of the stuff that he has from when he was a kid and stuff like that. But yeah, yeah, bro, the whole Pokemon thing is kind of sick. Yeah, I they think did it, make it interesting. I love the game cool. though. Yeah, the game. Yeah. Cool. yeah, yeah, I love cool. the game. Yeah, the games are definitely very. I cool. I burnt myself out of the cards. I just wasn't invested enough in the cards. I didn't mm. play the actual card game. I just me neither. To trade them. Me too. Yeah. Same, so same. Awesome. That's the same with yeah. me. So. I didn't care about the actual rules of the game. Not like Yu-Gi-Oh. I actually learned how to play Yu-Gi-Oh. The really? hard game. That shit was lit. Yeah. Yeah, this nigga Brandon used to terrorize niggas at, in college. <laughs> he, would be, he would be playing Yu-Gi-Oh. Yeah. These niggas, these niggas didn't want to play with him no more because they felt like he was cheating. Because he kept beating niggas. <laughs> Were you? No. So be like, Yu-Gi-Oh. Oh, wait. Turn your yeah, mic yeah, on. Yeah, Put the, uh, the turn on the mic on. If is it's it, not on. Is it flicked up? Yeah. Should be good right now. All right, oh, try you again. know what? Hold on one second. Test, test. One yeah. Second. You're good. He just needs more. Can you hear him now? Are y'all still? Yeah, yep. we're good. Okay, okay. We're okay. Good. Yeah, those days. You remember they were bad because you know those kids helped me out when I got there, right? Because remember it was everybody from high school. Yeah, the, uh, yeah, yeah. Antonio was there. Yeah. And so then we got those kids that was there, and we, I didn't know anything about the decks, right? Yeah. But you all used to go over there. It used to antagonize them, so they used to get so bad. <laughs> I used to terrorize the nigga. Well, he was, <laughs> like what? <laughs> he be playing. I'd be like, yeah, this nigga fucking y'all up. Oh, oh yeah. 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 Make a little commentary. Yeah. Got you. Okay. <laughs> Over Yu-Gi-Oh, nigga. Them Yo. nerds was getting hot. <laughs> they was getting Damn. so mad, hey, bro. Up, but you know, they don't, they don't have the social skills for regular life, so you know, let alone... <laughs> yeah, bro. They're that losing. added pressure. They're losing in their car game. Yeah. I'm over there like, shit. Yeah. <laughs> just adding, yeah. just like, just all the peanut gallery sound effects. <laughs> yeah. I know, they hated that shit. <laughs> yeah. uh, but before we uh, dive yeah. deeper into this rabbit hole, can we yeah. go up to the uh, last week's episode? Also, mm-hmm. for everybody that's here right now, appreciate y'all. Um, uh, make sure if you want to hear it, like we play music during the show too. Yeah. And some just stuff can't be cleared on YouTube. So um, make sure y'all check out the audio. It's on like all streaming services, uh, Apple Podcasts, Spotify, and all that stuff. Yeah. But um, last episode, y'all went crazy. No, no, it was. It was the one. No, you no, had. no. It was the yeah. yeah. I, thought I, I thought I clicked away from it. My fault. No, YouTube just fucks up like that sometimes. Yeah, it was this one. Yeah, y'all was in the comments. This episode did crazy too. It did good. It was at uh, it yeah. did one point eight or yeah. one point nine or something. It's almost at two K, pretty much. Yeah, it's pretty much there. Yeah, but uh, yeah, yeah, nine. Go yeah. to the comments. Seven, seven. The comments was lit. That was me. Oh, oh okay, yeah, yeah. okay. It fell out. 
This is actually the best pod on the channel. Oh, shit. AJ, <laughs> yeah, uh, yeah, the comments were overwhelming. Let's go at zero to Lou for Shane for not letting uh, AJ skate over. <laughs> <laughs> Skate over the beef. The wrap up was needed. Another great episode. Dope episode. All the topics are dope. Group identity being tribal is a pr <clears throat> primal need. Becoming an individual Shit. who you really are is enlightening and also hard as fuck. Yeah, niggas what? is in the comments, uh -huh. man. That was what no, we were no, no, about. but yeah, but that's yeah, yeah. The yeah, comments the, was lit last week. The wrap up of the beef. Yeah, yeah. Shane they, was a fan favorite per usual. That's <laughs> that's that's how it's always been two years though. Uh, somebody just, somebody DM me though. Because yeah. remember I said, I was like, nigga, this is why, this is why I can go toe-to-toe, -to -toe, niggas, because I'd be yeah. going back and forth with Shane. Yeah. <laughs> somebody was like, they was like, they, somebody put it and said, whew, uh, yeah. Shane was applying that pressure, nigga. Uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Wait, wait, did you see what I said, though? Uh, uh, go, go back up. Uh, that 9-11 joke was disgusting. People died. I was like, whoops. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, man, it was a, a necessary evil. evil. Yeah. I'm sorry. <laughs> I saw that one. That was the only person who this seemed to be. This whole T-Pen thing like, really. is insane, my nigga. Are they I saying you look like him or sound like no, him? No, I, I sound like, they say I sound like oh, T-Pen. Oh, T-Pen. Like uh, it's been very consistent. You sound like T-Pen. Really? That's what they say. You do not Matter of like fact, we need to pull Maybe up T-Pen. I don't listen to him talk enough. We need to listen to this podcast so I can, we can hear it because, yeah, I've been getting T-Pen all year. T-Pen voice. Isn't his southern accent like really thick yeah i it's think so oh, it's pretty thick yeah he has a very distinct voice he does yeah. that's why i'm like but it's i don't know i don't hear it i haven't heard him in a while but at the same time um it's so consistent go down to one of those shorts maybe like go back. yeah shorts or live i think it's because no, go back to i think maybe it's because y'all yeah, the same complexion maybe. or something all right scroll down or similar complexion or one of these that he's in the studio that yeah, far right the one on the far right yeah yeah like that I'm cool with being in the studio, but like chasing a number one or like, you know, all that, you, you, you miss the, you miss all the shots you don't take and it, I get that, but I'm not about to be in this bitch making 18 songs a day just so one of them can be received well and then we'll try to go with that. Look, I make music because I like making music. I get it. You, you want to be at the top of the game, but that's, I've done that and I'm good <laughs> yeah, on that boss. shit. It's not like. I, I don't hear it. I, I don't hear it. <laughs> People have been saying that for a while, bro. <laughs> I don't know what to hear. It sound like a you have a deeper. It's just deeper. A deeper version. Yeah. yeah, yeah. He is kind of a. Hmm. I don't yeah, know. He has something. Plus, he's like Somebody, a thick Tallahassee accent or whatever. Yeah, because he's from Florida. Tallahassee, Florida. Florida. Yeah. yeah. Mm. Somebody said that you sounded like a comedian or something like that. Some black comedian, and I thought maybe you sounded closer to him than T Pain. Which comedian? Mm. I, I can't remember. Some, yeah, some who, who black he was. bald guy, but but yeah, I I don't know. I don't personally hear it. <laughs> Me neither. But it's yeah, consistent. It's, here. I mean, it's, it's consistent, though. <laughs> oh, really? <laughs> no, it's definitely consistent. Oh, shit. I got hit with the, um, somebody finally, for the first time, somebody said I look like Hannibal Burrs. I knew, that, I knew that was coming. They say I look, I look like Zesty Hannibal Burrs. Zesty? Man. Why did they have to put the Zesty, yeah, on, they zesty on there? <laughs> yeah, well, why did they have to put the Zesty Dude, on They always add the Zesty now. This shit's crazy. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe it's just popular to do. <laughs> it just um, what was I about popular. to say? Um, what, oh, what I was going to say was uh, did, j maybe just to wrap up the video game thing. Like me and my cousins, when we were in St. Thomas, yeah. we, were, we got into a discussion of like video games as well. And we were saying how, how come every like fire video game had to have one, char one Bruce Lee character? That's true. E yeah, That's true. Every video game had to have a what the? Character. And honestly, sure. I probably <laughs> picked him first most yeah, of the time. Exactly. And he was usually nice. Yeah, he yeah, 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 yeah. Good probably, Always. Probably picked him first and then learned the other characters yes, later. Yes, yeah. shout, shout out to Liu Kang. Shout out to Fei Long. I was just, yeah, Fei Long. No. Uh, Law from uh, Law. Tekken. Law, that's what I was thinking, Law. I just say Bruce Lee for him. He's obviously Bruce Lee, but we can't it's say Bruce Lee. Bruce Lee. Bruce Lee, yeah, yeah but it damn sure Lee. is. <laughs> it, it looks just like him. Put him in the same outfits, all same that. Same style of fighting. Yeah, all that shit. <laughs> His back clip was savage. Oh, or Law? Uh, yeah, yeah, Law's it was, it was a cheap move, and once you figured it out, just bust it every time. Yeah, yeah. yeah. the spam back flip to the low, yep. or the low I to the back flip. Yep, I, <laughs> I spam that back flip. Nigga, you're not touching the ground again. <laughs> <laughs> didn't, it, didn't it automatically break even a down block? Yep. Yeah. Because it's a, technically a overhead. Crazy. Yeah. So come come mm. up off the ground, nigga. Crazy. Nothing you can <laughs> do and about then that. And then I'm going to just keep you bouncing in the air. <laughs> But it's just like Liu Kang with his fucking flame, whatever it's called. Like, because, you know, like, um, not Ryu, but uh, Fei Long, he had his own shit. See, me, Fei Long and Law are the ones that I used to always get confused because they they were the ones that really looked like Bruce Lee. Fei Long looked right, like himself because right. he had long hair. Yeah. Sometimes like a 
you know, headband or something like that. But Fei Long and Law, the ones I, I always got, I'm just like, okay, I guess it's just Bruce Lee. Right, straight right. Straight off, straight up Bruce Lee. Because they have the Enter the Dragon yeah, fit. They, yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Just the black right. pants, pants, the short hair, and the little Chinese this shoes with yeah. socks in them. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, the animated movie, though. Yeah, the, I, we watched that when we were in St. Thomas, too, me and my brother. Was this that, that Marvel vs. Capcom? Uh, you talking about the movie? Is that what this game is no, on the far right? That's Street the new yeah, Street, Fighter the new, uh, Street Fighter Five. Oh, that's Street Fighter. That's yeah. right. Yeah, Marvel oh, yeah, vs. Yeah, Ca- Marvel vs. Capcom kind of looks like that a little bit. Oh, that was pretty. Maybe good game. not really. Oh yeah, he had the fire kick. That's what it was. Marvel vs. Capcom. My only issue with them, like, don't give me too many choices on character. <laughs> <laughs> it's overwhelming. Well, I mean, I mean, there's only three choices that matter: Wolverine, so Hulk, correct. Wolverine's nasty. And uh, Iron Man, just for, like, pressure from distance. I, okay, Iron Man is one. Yeah, he could just devastate you from the other side of the map, and I don't think that's mm-hmm. fair. <laughs> Which yeah. Marvel vs. Capcom are you all talking about? Uh, I guess two. Yeah, two is probably the best two one. Two is fire. Two mm-hmm. is fire. I thought Doom was really good, though. Doom was decent. I remember the, that. The Doom games. You Yo, it's crazy. I remember the old Doom game oh, being scary, Doom and it was like Oh, no, I'm not talking about Doom. Doom. I mean, like, Dr. Doom and Marvel's Oh, Dr. Doom. Oh, yeah. Oh, the character. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're about okay. to go into Doom. Yeah, because yeah, yeah, I remember yeah. that. Don't feel bad. I thought the same thing. I was like, oh, wow, we go with that? Oh, yeah, yeah. Remember the pixelated titties? Yes. And Doom? Yeah. Crazy. I don't remember. I feel like I saw those go viral on, like, a Reddit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. On, like, a forum. Oh, 4chan. Yeah, on some 4chan shit. Shit. Thank God I never, yo, you know what's funny is like, I never even uh, learned how to do that. Like get onto some some of those things to even get lost or caught up in that world. Like back when they were popping, like, um, what do they call them? Forums. Forums, the yeah. dark forums. The dark yeah. forums and stuff like that. Yeah, I, didn't, I didn't know how to even access them. Yeah, yeah where are they? Yeah, yeah, but they're still active though, right? Yes. They're I don't like, know. They're, like, they're yeah. alive and well. Yeah. You said that oh, really well, quick. Well, some are. Oh, some are. are. Yeah. <laughs> So what? A lot of our 4chan has like died down over the years. It's still got the same cesspool, but yeah. Was 4chan the one that uh, Doja Cat was on in, in the was Intel it? groups? I think so. Yeah, I yeah, think yeah. it was. 4chan. Oh no, no, yeah. you're right. 4chan. Yeah, yeah I think because it was because I remember 4chan. around that time 4chan was like. Um, That's where all the QAnon drops. Th- right? Yeah, they were in yeah. like controversy for all their racist shit. Yeah, right. But Which Reddit just took over everybody pretty Reddit? much. Right. Yeah, Reddit. That's Swept true. everybody Reddit up. Is a race. Just, yeah, Reddit is a real race. It's all encompassing. Yeah. Oh, so that's what it was. Okay. 4chan is an English language image board website that users can post and discuss pictures and other images anonymously in forums or sub forums called boards. Yeah, these shits were crazy. Two thousand three. The, the, the people that like create these things, bro, like they just like ran up hundreds of millions and then just we never saw them again. Do y'all? Do y'all know? <laughs> have y'all seen Christopher Moot Pool? Have y'all seen him? You don't even no. see. Him? Like what he looks Pool. like. Yo, he was he, 15. He, no. um, yeah, he's like, I don't know, he has some kind of like um, uh, birth defect or something, and he's like, he's in a wheelchair. I think it's that what? guy. If, if it's the guy I'm thinking of. I'll see this. Oh, no, okay, so it's different. Who's oh. the guy? Have y'all seen the documentary about the guy who, who did all the, um, Nigga, that guy the looks, drops for QAnon? That guy looks freaky. No. Mm-mm. That guy looks freaky. Oh, okay. So maybe... I mean, he, might be the, he might be the owner of it now. Uh, this is the nigga that created 4chan? Oh, it's the guy that created it. This is created around. founder. That's what he said. Yeah. He looks like he looks like nah, a go back, um, to, go back to like a, that picture on the far right. Go to that first one. He looks like an alternate universe. The first Facebook in that row guy. and the last in that <laughs> row look crazy. Say it again. Oh, uh, that's small. So you go back to Wait, the, uh, go to the last row, one in from the right. Yeah, right. No, one over to the left. Yeah. <laughs> that makes it scary. Search, <laughs> search his, uh, search his uh, uh, arrest. That like, he does it. Homie, he looks like cursed Mark arrest. Zuckerberg. No, you know what he looks like? He's saying in that hey, picture. Go to, go to, yeah. go to, go to all. Yeah. Let's see if he's ever got arrested. No, no. In that picture, it looked like he was saying, "Like, hey, you want to see something?" Right. Yeah. <laughs> so, you know what? I don't think I do. <laughs> I don't want to see something. Ah. <laughs> he looks he like a guy that will create a forum with no mods on Is it. Is this real? <laughs> yeah. I don't think so. Because it would have been arrested. It's just an N. I don't think this is real. Yeah. What does the comment say? Attempted. What? Wait. What? Hold up. Did it say attempted murder? I don't really say much. It's so random. So, I don't know. Uh, scandalous disinformation. That's all I saw. Oh, okay. You can go back. Oh, yeah. No, no, yeah, but yeah, he looks scary as shit. He looked like yeah. Top. Yeah, he looked freaky. <laughs> Thank God for me. All my niggas gonna lie for me. All my bitches gonna <laughs> me. 
Only uh, certain kind oh, of people create you know what I was going to ask? So. Um, so your shirt, we look real Republican now. Hey, man. I figured, <laughs> oh, yo, man. I figured, I figured I the hat said. would match the shirt. You know what I'm saying? It, does. Uh, yeah. it definitely you know, does. Camo with the drink. So yeah. you go on. So it was, this is Reagan and Bush. Reagan Bush, man. This is from this is from 84 at that. It's oh, like, wow. where did you get hey, that? Born. Some random ass store, man. I don't even know. That, that shit is, that, that shit's an artifact. Crazy, yeah. right? That's yeah. an artifact, nigga. And so what about, what about it draw, draw you to it? <laughs> that is from 84? Or that it's Reagan and Bush? No, he's asking. Yeah. Oh. Oh, oh, draw you oh, to the shirt. It's yeah, like a, it's like a shirt. piece of history. Hey, it is ironic because it's it's Reagan and Bush who like Reagan, depending on who you ask, was mm. like either the worst or the best thing for black people. Yeah, true, mm. true. Yeah. I've heard so, that yeah, before. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So you get really mixed opinions, and I'm like, I wasn't even alive in '84, mm. but it's pretty I funny was, that yeah. like, they have the shirt. You know what? Yeah. I also remember too. I also remember. Um, and Stranger Things, it was when they were yeah, running. Yeah, yeah. And they had those yard signs yeah. in people's mm -hmm. houses and stuff like that of the yeah. Reagan and the Bush administration because it was during that time period. Right? Yeah, and w one of my favorite, like, I didn't really know about that time period, really, the politics. Yeah. Until uh, one of my favorite movies, Donnie Darko, is uh, what I got a tattoo from. Um, th it takes place in the 80s. And... I heard them talking about Reagan and Bush, but I didn't even know who I knew who Bush was, but I didn't know who Reagan was. Like right. I wasn't politically minded around that time I was watching it. And this but that's Bush when I learned Senior. about that. Right. Yeah. Yeah. Bush yeah, Senior. yeah, Bush yeah. Bush. yeah. Yeah. So I didn't know much about what was going on until that movie. Mm. Oh, okay. I see yeah. what you're saying. Yeah, I saw the documentary. The Just Say No documentary. Just say no. And that's how I learned that. about Reagan. Mm-hmm. When I saw Bush, I was like, Bush wasn't at 84, but then I thought about his father, his daddy. Yeah, senior. Yeah, yep. yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah we, we dealt with Junior. Yeah, we dealt with Junior. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, 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 that's yeah. right. Yeah, boy, Which junior. is so crazy, nigga. Father and son. These niggas run Texas. Y'all know that? No. <laughs> yeah, you know, they run Texas. Texas. Oh, no, no. His yeah. brother was Florida. Yeah, yeah they yeah, run brother, Texas, other, Florida, yeah. and the country. Yeah, yeah. 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 They, they, like, They're like the Kennedys, kind of. That, you know, nigga, they're, that they're family, family is insane. I just... On some American shit. Yeah, I'm yeah. surprised we don't have a Bush running right now. Like, yeah, like, a, like who's a, the next one in line? There's got to be another one in line soon, Kennedy. right? I'm well, sure there's, there's a probably, Kennedy, there's but a with the whole trying to get on. pilot, the way it looks now, they're probably just trying to save everybody yeah. before it all goes Speak, complete. Speaking of Kennedys, Robert, Kennedy Robert F. Kennedy, he need to just give it up. You think so? <laughs> get the fuck out of here. Oh, that I think I feel yeah. like um, it's. Would you it's vote just, for him? Hell no! It's just because the anti vax shit. It gets weird. It gets weird from there. It's not even anti vax shit. It's his voice. I don't know. You can't man. Him. That you can't nigga hear can't him. be my I know, president. But, I don't know. It's, it's I don't know. But speeches would be hard. He's younger than both. Can you of imagine? Them. I don't know. He's like for me, it's age. So it's like, do I really want him? Because he sounds crazy than all the other Kennedys. Mm -hmm. But it's like I, I at least know he'll be able to pass a physical. <laughs> nah, fuck that. His voice. He sound like he about to die, nigga. He does like, sound like and he, every vo every word sounds like it hurts. It hurts. <laughs> and he admitted to, to, to having brain yeah. worms. Yeah, he, he yeah. admitted to having uh, pork, yeah, what pork based on? brain worms. What? Oh no! What? Oh no! Yeah. Oh no! Mm -mm. He did. He did. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. The, the, reason I mean, the reason I mean, the reason I mean, I mean, it's relevant to go okay. to YouTube real quick. Mm -hmm. This nigga was on Tasha K. I said, give it up. What? <laughs> give it the fuck up. <laughs> It's crazy. What are you doing at that's Tasha K? K? He'll go on anybody's podcast. He will, care. bro. Yeah. He will. And that's why I just, I'm just like, you know. But I agree the voice. Uh, it hurts me. To, it, it hurts me. How many views does this have? 35K. 35K. And it was one day ago? Yep. Okay. Yeah. Just skip halfway. It doesn't matter. This nigga's voice is terrible all the time. <laughs> of Kobe no Bryant. And so he said he's been holding this. And it was actually his friends that you just described that... Uh, kill this young white girl at the time. It wasn't your cousin. So we and then repeatedly and then repeatedly confessed to it. Right. So we're gonna go ahead and, and play Tony's confessional receipt time. Let's go. Yo, good, yeah. Burr, <laughs> okay, yeah, skip so he can we can hear more of his talking. Yeah, F Mac just, just find his, his jaw drops. So this that is that his oh, cousin? Man. Did extract, and that's what happens when yeah, you don't Tasha, tell the whole story. Up. It was like clip after <laughs> clip of you. And by the way, Tasha, uh huh. This is, you know, this is not kind of a, a spontaneous story that's that's appearing on the media. This is being pumped. Those videos are being created by Joe Biden and the DNC because they're trying to discredit me. To, you know, hurt my support among black my support among black Americans is growing exponentially. I'm going on all the podcasts. I'm talking about the program about 
He was on flag. Oh, how are we going to get capital back into the black communities? How are we going to restore all these? She's trying to tell him to drink some water, low key. <laughs> she's drinking water for him. Yeah, she's trying to. She's trying to be like, drink some water, bro. Drink some oh, really? Oh man. Yeah, she's, she's, she's trying to. You know, she's drinking water for him. Yeah, she's like, you need to do what I'm doing right now. Because you could feel it. That won't, that won't hurt. That won't help. No, I know. Nothing will save him. Come it on, just, man. Come it, it really, you know what it sounds like? He could throw up at any minute. Like, yeah. that's what it's just like. He's just on the verge. He's he just got a raspy up. voice. Imagine, okay, <laughs> Putin, okay, Putin just sent nuclear war, nu- nuclear ships to Cuba. Really? Right, yeah. Awesome. What's up, nigga? Why are we you starting know? this again? Why yeah, we gotta it's go like, wait a minute. Wait a minute. <laughs> oh, gosh, bro. For real? Yeah, 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 for sure. Submarines. Oh, no, no. Submarines or something like that. You're right. You're right. You're right. Speaking of Putin, you know what I was just thinking recently? I think we need to go ahead and get that nigga up out of here. Oh, be careful, bro. Because he doing a lot of he doing a lot of peacocking, and he ain't really. It's if I'm being, uh, you're taking too long with uh, Ukraine. If you know, I mean, if nukes if are if right. you're, if you're trying to win, if you if the goal is to take Ukraine, it's taking you a long fucking time. I don't think the goal is to take Ukraine, and I don't I don't think it's the goal either. But that's how you made it. See, remember the nigga right. was parading. Flamethrowers and shit around. He was shit that, mm-hmm. shit that was banned. You know yep. what I'm saying? Geneva like, Convention. You, oh, really? We're not honoring Geneva Convention yeah, now. Yeah, okay, yeah. Doing well, a, you know, he's just doing a lot of like peacock. Then he was threatening all of America. He was like, if anybody yeah. interferes with what I'm doing, your country will face nuclear annihilation or something. No, he he said it. He didn't even use those words. He said. Re- repercussions that your history has never seen. Oh, really? Yes. Oh. That's what he said. Because I thought that's so where Trump like, got the oh, oh, shit. oh, wow. Okay. <laughs> repercussions that your history has never seen? Never seen. Holy shit. You know right, what I'm right, saying? You better yeah, be yeah. careful, So man. you doing all this pump faking, Yo. nigga. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? And now you moving shit over here. So we saying. already funding the whole U- Ukraine. <laughs> Yo, wait, wait, wait. Like, we yeah. are funding it. It's time. To, it's, I, I'm almost to where I'm like, let's just get this nigga to fuck about it. Because he's doing too much <laughs> I mean, now. Damn. Yo, what could he possibly mean? We dropped a nuke on somebody before. Yeah. I mean, we dropped an atom bomb. It wasn't a nuke. Nukes Correct. are like 100 times. Like, there is not going to be no island once those things start uh, dropping. Yeah, but once we start popping off the nukes, it's really over. But yeah, I'm we just have saying, atomic if we're about to have somewhere. aliens and all this other stuff about to come, why are we sitting here beefing? What are we still beefing about? You can't have Wait, Ukraine. Wait, what do you think the aliens are I was about to say, you just said that like it was a uh, fact. The UFOs <laughs> that's been popping around? No, no, I've been looking into that a little bit. Like, okay. the, the, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> just threw that in there. Not, yeah, like, no, 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 just like, knowledge. I'm like, yeah. Yeah. are y'all getting a but newsletter that we all missed? The funny part of it is like, Shane jumped out with it. Wait, no, no, he's talking about some shit. Not personal things that, like, I haven't delved, but but, but it's like this see, guy yeah. who does usually does like movie related content. Uh-huh. He also does like this alien show, like based on like UFOs and all that shit. Yeah, and I'll pop in every once in a while just to hear hear it. What's gotcha. going on? But okay. he'll show some footage, and people don't know if it's like the government, a, a new toy that we don't know of, mm. or if if this is just like some shit. I don't you know. know. From, yeah, the internet's been going crazy, so. I did okay. I did read an article this morning that said they've been hearing some signal that's been like going every few seconds or every few minutes for the last couple months here. They've mm-hmm. from outer space. It's been this this steady signal and then it stops. And the steady signal and then that it means stops somebody has to, try to communicate. Somebody had to have gone up to Joe Rogan recently to talk about this. Then right? <laughs> oh, ben, oh ben the Carson guy with the, yeah, the guy with the, with the little gray uh, beard. The, no, 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 no. Carson. But, but Carson, you're you're right. He's he's a black dude, right? Uh, Billy Carson. Oh, yeah, he's the Billy one who talks about the I but, watched his uh, episode, but he he did something. Oh, he was on Flagrant. Yeah. Oh, he was. Yeah, he was on fl- flagrant. Oh, okay. He, he, Billy Carson. You said. No, I can't remember his name. It but is it's something Carson. Carson. It's like Ben Carson or something. But no, you hold, on, hold on. Ben, oh yeah, hold on. Ben Carson is the one who was running Billy for Carson. president. Yeah, it's, it's Billy Carson. Oh, Billy so Carson. it's Billy Carson. Oh, yeah. okay. that nigga. Okay. Sorry, yes. sir. You like? Yeah. Well, I am. Yo. <laughs> yeah, I, I watched his whole episode on on flagrant because, like, like I said, with the the alien stuff, I'm neither here nor there. But but the way like I had to listen, to, and he was just on Joe Rogan. But I had to listen to his stuff because there was one point where he got like emotional talking about his personal experience with an alien encounter. Oh shit! And, and even like, uh, what's his name? Um, uh, you know how good? Forget his name. The host of it. Fucking Schultz. Oh, oh Schultz. Schultz. Oh, okay, yeah, okay. Schultz, oh, Schultz was like, okay, I, I, I was gonna call you on some bullshit, but the you started your- sweating when you were telling this story. Right, right, so, right. So I was like, I don't know, man. <laughs> yeah. You see the Michael Jordan face on the thumbnail. <laughs> oh my God! Yeah, he does. He looks like that constantly. <laughs> that crying Jordan <laughs> he face. Does, he does it like a crying Jordan. Yeah. Yeah, it's clearly making him upset. Oh, they don't have no timestamps either. Nah, but it's because it's because it, it's a clip. Oh, 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 okay. Can't hear it though. Yeah, yeah. fighting tears. And anyway, so um, I was working on this project. I come home. I'm looking at ESPN, 
And I'm looking at sports about nine o'clock p.m. All the lights turn dim, the TV turns off, and I thought my kids were playing a trip, trick on me because they lived up in the room behind me up on the second floor. And I look up and there's nobody there. When I turn around, there were these two beings right there. Get the fuck out of here. Yeah. And, uh, whew. Man, hold on. Whoa. Sorry. No, no, no. Why do you have to freak yourself, man? No, <laughs> Because he lost his family over it. So they were right there. I'm sitting in a chair about this high, so they were right here in my eyes. And uh, (laughs) Alex is freaking out. (laughs) 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 He's wiping up the This is wild. Okay, okay, okay. All right, let me get myself together. No, no, take your time. So they were there. They had the big almond eyes like you said. Well, because the grabbing. (laughs) Schultz is hilarious. It's like, I just... (laughs) It's hard to watch and enjoy it now because he does so many cringy things. Now, what would you, you know? do in that moment? Like, would you just get off? <laughs> you just know, I just know that's what's gonna do. We've talked about yeah. it so much yeah, on no, home no, yeah, You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Yeah. That like his touching is him crying is throwing the entire. It's throwing him and Alex off. Uh, he don't oh, know what okay. to do. Because yeah. he's not responding properly this, to. This, yeah, this thing is nervous emotional. as hell. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah he's like, I like holy that's, shit! This I feel like this black man is crying right now. I feel like a black dude crying on his show is the only thing he's not prepared for. That's what I'm saying. I can tell. I can tell at this point that was the last thing in your mind that would ever have happened. Yeah. You heard his reaction, right? He's like, holy yeah. shit. He's like, ha, ha, ha. <laughs> Stop he crying, had, mother. He had to laugh it off. Yeah. He to laugh yeah. It. He's like, whoa, it got insane in here. You can see him. They're just white knuckling through this right now. So real yeah, quick, because we're not going to yeah, watch this whole thing. No, 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 he, yeah. he said he lost his family over this. Yeah, yeah. So he told, he, you know, he's been telling that story and all that stuff. And like, it got more severe and... Um, you know, tension between him and his wife and, and the kids okay. don't even want to speak to him and, and all that stuff. Like he's the like, crazy he's the crazy guy. guy. Yeah, yeah, but yeah. he's dying on this hill. He's like, this shit fucking happened. I don't know what to tell you. Um, so when I was listening to that, I was like, damn, I need to watch this whole thing. Let me make some popcorn. Yeah. <laughs> damn. Yeah. But yeah, so that's what kind of, um, with aliens, I was always like, I, I don't know. I, I'm not even caring what's going on. But, but after this story, I was like, hmm. I don't know. <laughs> I just say that to say I leave all possibilities open. Yeah. Right now. Yeah, and I don't I don't see a world that we're not already integrated with them. Yeah, like back right. in, you know, the fucking right. 50s and they're shit. They're probably just face swapping at this point if they're <laughs> Yeah, like you know what I'm saying? Like yeah, I, I feel you. like there's no way there's not some other form of life for sure. Because we're a weak form of life. We can't even survive in space. <laughs> yeah. And it's or or in the ocean. Yeah, yeah no way. And else. it's unlimited. Yeah. But okay. we're surviving and we're thriving. Right. Just as, right for sure. As a human race. So yeah. yeah of course there's gotta be something stronger than yeah. us out there doing their thing or whatever. And if, right. yeah. if not, or just like here amongst us already. Yeah. Exactly. They gotta be amongst us. Like yeah. I like to tell people, I was born at night, but I wasn't born last night. Yeah. <laughs> no, because, yeah. yeah no, 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 you're right. Uh, Because I was about to say, that's another thing, too. It's like, bro, the galaxy is unlimited, nigga. Right. Yeah, yeah. All we we think about is our solar system. Mm -hmm. That shit is minute minute compared to the infinite, endless space. And that's the the part that gets confusing is that some people will just talk about the fact that there's just other planets and there might be life on other planets. But then when you start, like, delving into, like, different dimensions and how many, you know, black holes and, you know. (laughs) Most people start talking about quantum theory. I leave it alone. I'm yeah, like, the black holes and shit. Where does it pop out at? Infinite, yeah, a whole infinite. Other? Yeah. yeah, yeah, infinite. Okay. Like di- just dimensions. Like people will say, like there's an Earth. There's many Earths in yeah, other different galaxies, and it's the same thing happening, but different choices. It's I, reversed I don't know. Earth. Yeah, yeah. So Gosh. I'm like, <laughs> you know, like, it's like you, when you open up that hole, it's just you just fall in. Yeah, bro. <laughs> yeah, yeah. That's why. I had to that's how we got the simulation out. theory. The simulation theory yeah. was born out of yeah. stuff like that. Right. The multiversism. Yeah. And all of that. Yeah. But it's impossible to not become the crazy nigga. It's uh, impossible. If, it's if, impossible. If, if, if that's the rabbit hole you fall yes. down. Yeah. So it's impossible. I definitely think they exist. But here's my thing. I think that we're in a weird state right now because I think we're in limbo. I think mm. that maybe, perhaps, we were visited a long time ago. But I think we're in a weird period where we're, we're advanced enough that we can't be visited because we're just going to shoot at them or something. We're just going to mm. do something stupid. like, like Okay. But... Back in the day, like the Egyptians, I still like, ain't no way they built that pyramid. 
in a way, in my mind. Okay, yes. Okay? Yeah. So I think we've been visited. I think, And also, I think a lot of other things, I think like that's how I think of a lot of mythologies came about. I think they were visited. And back, back in the day, they could appreciate them. When they were visited, they would accept facts. them. They would worship yeah, them. That's right, facts. They would allow them. They, they could gods. comfortably visit. They were gods to them. Yeah. We can't accept that nowadays. No, so, we're so shooting at anything. We're shooting at it. it. Yeah. Yeah. Just ozone. And think plus, about it. they have nothing that we can give them except for probably like our earth resources or something. I don't know. Not even that. We offer people. Like, you know that African tribe? That name, that planet, that scientist just found, what is it called? Sirius B or whatever? Yeah, oh, yeah. I know what you're talking about. There yeah, was, yeah. That draw what, validates your whole point right there. That's what I'm saying. I think that they had some How did they know a planet outside our solar system if they haven't been visited before? Right. Mm -hmm. mm. And Bill, uh, no, okay. no, and Billy Carson, everything that you're saying is what Billy Carson was also talking about before he started telling his personal story. Yeah, right, he, right. Yeah, he was telling about all the pyramids and how it became, like, came from different life forms before humans were created and they created humans. Like, he was he making was a compelling deep. case. He was. Right. I watched you that know? episode. Yeah. It was it, like, let me just scratch your chin at least. Mm -hmm. yeah. I walked away like, hmm, wait a yeah, minute. Yeah, yeah. Mm. I, I get that. Like, and, on take, top, right. and on top of that, all of this could be true, right? Mm -hmm. But it's about finding the balance of, is this consuming you? Right. Uh, you, you know what I mean? You can't right. sleep and because, shit. Because it could consume you so much, like, I know the truth now, and now your life mission is to turn other people from the truth, but now you are automatically crazy. Yeah, yeah. or when you get the paranoia. Because remember, I told yes. you, that's what I got when I yeah. started going down those conspiracy rabbit holes. Mine was mostly with, like, the s Satan stuff, you know? Okay, death um, and stuff yeah, like yeah, that. Yeah, that's the shit yeah. that was, like, you know, the cult, like, double cults and yeah. right. Hollywood oh, and, man. and all that shit. Yeah. I went down that rabbit hole, and, and that had me peeking out blinders and <laughs> I'm shit. Still that that was the yeah. You're still in there? You're still in there? You doing okay? <laughs> I'm losing my mind, bro. Every day I feel like a hero. <laughs> uh, my movie is for you. Man. <laughs> Bro, like, when yeah. um when last night when I was asking Brandon J, I was like, you know how to get on the dark web? You gonna show me at some point? And he was like, oh no, nah, man, you know uh, once you uh, see certain things, they can't be unseen. <laughs> I was like, whoa. Yeah, he's not wrong. <laughs> yeah, I was like, shit. It's a valid point. You know what? No. You're right. I, obviously, I don't yeah. need to be there. No, no, no yeah, because I've gone, I've seen like dark web shit, but it's like. When you see like like dead bodies and stuff like that, it's just like oh my god! It starts oh, getting creepy. This was when the internet was like free for all. Too. Yeah, yeah, you know. But like it's still active. Net, uh, Isn't it crazy Napster that there's Day. just a dark web place <laughs> yeah. right it's now? It would be hooked up to the internet, but since the internet is still unregulated, they had to like break off the. Because the way people find us is the DNS, the main name system. Yeah. And the reason why you, like, in order to access the dark web, you got to type in IP address again. Yeah, right, right. It's because, like, certain stuff on there, like, you could get access to and not be legal in your country. So then now you have violated the law of your country. You may not even know it. Mm. You know? Oh. And that's what it's weird because, like, the internet kids is not gonna not gonna know like us. They're born into the internet, mm -hmm. right? So everything is at their fingertips. We know what not to do now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 But to them, like, oh, uh, well, we I just got this, bro. Oh, yeah. and the, some the feds come knocking on your house. Yeah. What you gonna say? Just yeah, because you crazy. visited a website. Just because yeah, you visited right. a website and you didn't take the precautions to even block mm. yourself on that traffic. So they have yeah. to block that part up for your protection. Mm -hmm. Jeez. So you don't get hemmed up. Yeah. Just like having just the FBI Damn. knocking on your door because you just decided to do mm. a browse that's one insane. night. Yeah, that's, that's crazy. To get yeah. Yeah, just get swatted just to, mm -hmm. just like that. Oh man. But then if you know how to protect yourself, the fact that you could just go in there and buy five, you can get a grenade. <laughs> AK forty yeah. seven. Oh my god! You yeah. in there like and, looking uh, for enriched uranium? That's where they got shit. all their shit. You and know? a sixty five year old woman's left leg. And yeah. had that shit come right through USPS, nigga. Yeah, bro, that's <laughs> you know? that oh crazy, my god. Yeah, nigga, the shit that. Imagine you're the postal person and you can just somebody could just give you a database of all the packages that you've ever moved. <laughs> oh my god. Because you don't know, you know, yeah. you're just the regular UPS guy, yeah. uh FedEx guy or whatever. Yeah. But if there was like a database and you could see all the illegal things that you might have moved across the country <laughs> you were just yeah. Ju yeah, that you're muling but doing your job though. Unknowingly, yeah, yeah. 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 yeah I feel you. That's it'd be like insane. it'd be like seven thousand pounds, four hundred keys. <laughs> Uh, body parts, possibly. Yeah. Like, hey, it oh could be, a, it could be it's dark so web dark. stuff. You know, that's yeah, why I don't real. like to go. I mean, like to, but I don't want to like go down that rabbit hole because it's just like you just start to see like inhumane shit. Yeah. Once yeah. you start seeing that inhumane shit, is like it changes your whole outlook on life. It does, man. It changes your like, whole persona. It's like holy shit, people are like selling dead bodies and stuff. Like, yeah, like people are doing that. Like it's like they're harvesting organs. That's, what, that's what they, yeah, organs. yeah, that's what they, they wake yeah. up in the day and that's part Dude, of their schedule. And there's so, but to me, I'm looking at it just from a human perspective. I'm like, you're so locked off. 
that you could do that. <laughs> and, that I mean, could, and that could be the guy at Bojangles that's yeah, at the cash yeah. register. People that, around you. Yeah, and it could be somebody that we've interacted with at the but grocery store. I can't store judge those people. By the end of the like day, that. like the whole industry for organs, like let's say, oh, God forbid, zone, somebody yeah. needs a kidney yeah. and you have no matches, you have to go to the dark web to get a kidney to save oh. somebody's life. So or that's the good part. Like I'm, I'm paying oh, that you 30, can do that. Yeah, okay. I'll pay that. Like I'm probably not gonna protect that life. Damn, I didn't think about it like that. Yeah, like, I yeah. need a liver. Yeah, you could get one. But the problem is, you just don't know where they harvest it. Exactly, oh, bro. Yeah, that's right, the, right. So that's you the You go catch. into a more uh, uh, issue of ethnics and morals. Oh, yeah. definitely. At yeah. that point. And that oh, it's totally an Yeah, because now it's like, you've been on the waiting list for two years. You're having liver cancer. You are about to die, but you can buy one. You're not really sure where it's, but it's healthy. It's matched. The doctor risky, tested it. It's risky, but yeah. And uh, they said it'll work. It's like, yeah. Do you save your life and buy a possible... Liver from somebody that was har harvested or kidnapped, possibly. They yeah. caught some oh, tourists. Shit. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, like, I didn't even yeah, think about that. Yeah, like a, <laughs> yeah. That, that shit might have oh, been shit. involuntary oh, completely. Man. You know well, what I mean? That used to be yeah. a real problem in like I think like in in like the Cambodia or something like that. Like in, in that like countries. yeah, in some of those foreign countries where it's like ormond harvest. Like you just be a tourist up there. Somebody slip you a Mickey and you would just wake up with no kidneys. <sighs> oh, I've I've heard about those stories. In a like, bath of ice. Yeah, girls are go. Yeah, girls are go on vacation, get uh get drugged, wake up. In a bag, of, in a bath of ice, zit, uh, stitched up stitched, across their yep. stomach, but they didn't took a kidney out or some shit. That's it. Why even stitch you? Because I feel like you're gonna die. <laughs> They're keeping you alive, but in the most savage way. Right. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, it's vicious. You, it's you vicious. literally just had a hotel surgery after being abducted. <laughs> Damn. And then they sew you up. Mm. That's it's insane. Oh my god. That's why I'm real American. I ain't gonna lie. Like there's certain shit that I'm like, yeah, I'm really American because. I hear about some of the crimes and the violence in like South America and shit like that. Wow. I'm like, no, nah, I'm not built for that, nigga. No, nah, no, you're right. I, I can take a gunshot wound. I might die, but I'll take that. I don't want to get hit with a machete. I don't want. <laughs> I, I don't want to have a video yeah. where they're just like chopping my head off. You know right. what I'm saying? You're like, right. shoot yeah. me, please. Like, you oh, know what yeah, yeah. No, I'm Let me go quick, nigga. God yeah. damn, yeah. bro. Just, <laughs> can you imagine a dude being in like Chicago from O Block and like who's notorious for taking limbs mm -hmm. instead Come of on, killing bro. people? That's insane. Oh dude. my god! I just saw a machete fight on Twitter a couple days ago. Oh, a real oh shit! A real one, nigga. The nigga. The wounds are insane. The nigga's hand. He chopped his hand off in the fight. Ooh. It was. Oh my god! Ooh. It was a clean cut. It was a clean cut. And, yes. I, and you saw it. The, saw it wasn't it. blocked out. The nigga came back at the end of the fight and picked it up. <laughs> Good. Hey, his, 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 oh, this is it, right? He still yeah, has 24 yeah. hours to get it sold back on. This is and it, all right? the nerves will reset. It's a woman. You gotta open it up. I can't see nothing. Yeah, that's that was my fault. Oh, I was over here rocking. I was rocking back and forth. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yo, he just did it. No, I didn't see it. Yeah. yeah. Yo, yeah. it was go. a clean cut. You gotta, you gotta go, go back. back. Yeah, yeah. Okay, this gotta be Miami or something. <laughs> that's yeah, go, a real no, go G right there. You're gonna, you're gonna, you're gonna see how these niggas pull oh up on each other. Oh my god. The internet, man. You running the floor? <laughs> yep, there it goes. That was his Yep. Yep. That is the scariest shit in the world to see. Yep. One more time. He, he hold on, hold on. Watch. He's yeah. gonna okay. There's his oh, hand okay. right there on the ground. That's the dude that lost his hand. He about to come pick it up. It's just, it, it is leaking. It is just leaking. Come on, cameraman. Oh. Yeah. I hope somebody rushed him to the hospital so they can get it attached real quick. That's his hand. Picked it up. Oh, Imagine my. casually picking up your hand. All right. And well, he, po I he mean, pointed at him. He pointed at him with the, with the nub, man. Actually, I'm more scared of that guy. Right. You, right. You saw no. his, he had his he's hand chopped. He's not freaking out like his hand was just chopped I think off. He's, I think he's in so much shock that he can't feel. There's no way. Yeah, he, he, is, he, he hasn't, the pain hasn't hit yet. It's a, yeah, it's a saving it's private a, Ryan moment. Yeah. 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 Uh, Once uh, that yeah, pain also, hit, he's going to be screaming, yeah. bro. Yeah, because you also got to remember, bro. he just got into a machete fight. You can't feel Your adrenaline is up. Yeah, okay, so you can't feel anything. He's already in fight or flight already. Yeah, yeah. Good thing cybernetics is making it way. They traded blows. That was the crazy thing. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they both caught a couple. Yeah. That's what I'm saying. It wasn't like a one hit and they were done. They traded machete blows. Yes. Yeah. Which is crazy. That is insane. Shoot me. Yo. I, no, <laughs> I agree. I agree. No, straight up. Shoot me. I don't want to get into a machete fight with a nigga. That is Lose crazy. Bro. Shit, I don't even want to get hit, just hit one time. Yeah. Just have my shit wide open. Because it may, like, all of a sudden, it just split your face open. That's insane. Yeah. It's insane. Imagine if it's across the stomach, all your intestines coming out. Yeah. It would make people, that. I think it would make people take uh, conflict a little bit more seriously, though. 
Uh, you people be, were walking around with me. You wouldn't just start shit? shit with anybody if it was like back in the day where everybody had a sword. Oh, yeah, yeah. I was about to say that. Oh, I'm sure. used to walk like, around with swords. Had a machete. It's just sure. should be like that in general. I don't know where how the world just lost its mind recently, but... It got more humane because, I mean, we used to watch... Gladiator, we used to literally pay to go see people get killed. Yeah, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I mean, we do that now. Yeah. Well, so that's also, I feel like that's just an effect of like, like decadence of like, you know, if that's, that's an effect of that society was doing so well that they got um, Bored. degenerate. Well, they became degenerate. Oh, exactly. Okay, yeah, and we're yeah, on the true. verge of that UFC. We're, we're Bloodsport Blood Blood is making their way yeah, back. Yeah, yeah. So, like, like um, that is true, actually. Um, sex sells very casually, it becomes just like an open thing. Drug use becomes super open. Um, yeah. Yeah. Okay. All those things. I guess we are in that space. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Okay. No. Okay. No, I was gonna say, yeah, UFC is probably like the closest we probably have to like the For gladiator sure. thing. Yeah. For sure. I don't think people get killed, but you know, people get knocked down. Yo, well, I'm we like, all got to sign the death warrant. Like, you yeah. don't expect out there to go get killed, but yeah. you know, in case you do could. die, yeah. you yeah. know, nobody gets prosecuted. Same but. with the yeah, same with boxers. It's all the yeah, same boxing. for all of them. Yeah, I think boxing's. I think that one's a little different because that's like there's referees. It's a fair fight. They weigh the guys. They make, they make sure they weigh the same thing. They make sure they check their gloves. It's a little different. But there's there's referees in uh, UFC, UFC too. UFC too. Yeah. Right. yeah. I know, but yeah, so it's blood sport, but it's a very controlled blood sport. But you, but boxing, there's more deaths in boxing than there is in UFC. There is. Oh, actually, is there? Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah there oh, actually is. I did not. Yeah, there's more deaths. Wow. Yeah, because yeah. yeah, you're, you're knocking people around, but you're trying to save them with the softness of the glove, but you're really just shaking their brain around a lot. The padded oh, blows. Right. You know what I'm saying? When they should have been knocked out to protect themselves. Yeah, to protect themselves. Yeah. And all that yeah. shit, like. Their body should be shutting down so that it can go into a protection state. Right. Mm -hmm. yeah. But the gloves make them stay awake longer. So you're just yeah. knocking niggas senseless, legitimately. You yeah. shake, dude. You're shaking the baby. Yeah, yeah. straight up. And I, I think it that's is. Was, it um, is crazy how bad old uh, boxers are off. Like the how? old school ones. Like yeah. how they would just. It, it's dead. Yeah. Yeah, oh wait, the decline is rapid. Yeah. When is a uh, fucking Mike Tyson and then what's his name fighting? It's it's camper. It's December. Oh, did it, I th did it they cancel or it. did they push it? They canceled it. Yeah. I don't think it's gonna happen, bro. Yeah, I, don't you know, know, I gave up on that. I, I was like, happen. I wanted somebody to go to Jake Paul. I was like, Mike Tyson. I felt like, oh, We're there ain't no way you're gonna beat no, Mike November. Tyson. Uh, I just think it was just I a was, bunch of flow. I don't know. I honestly it says November twenty. November he 30. Had, I honestly didn't know. Mike Tyson was on an airplane and damn near they don't they didn't say what it was, but it seemed like he was on the airplane by himself, laid out on the ground for like twenty minutes. So oh, like, that's why they pushed it back because his health oh, went out. So oh, niggas are saying they were like, uh, uh, there's, 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 they're, they're speculating like he probably had a stroke on that plane or something. <laughs> it might have been unresponsive or something. They were in there doing CPR. Oh, well, yeah. because oh, wow. they cleared the plane out for 20 minutes and he was in there. Oh yeah, man, before he came out. I'll be all right. Yeah. So a stroke or or do you think it was even? They, is he they, on drugs? Or? They didn't release what it was. Okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. They ain't gonna tell you about mine. Does drugs? Or? Well, I guess Jake Paul is the greatest fighter still. <laughs> <laughs> he's, he's knocked out UFC combatants. <laughs> he nah. defaulted. Yeah. <laughs> he knocked out Mike Tyson without touching. <laughs> okay. <laughs> yeah. All right. So. Uh, yeah, but yeah pushed, so that's it what got I was pushed for. back. But when was it supposed to be? Supposed to be? I think it was supposed to be like what? next month. That's why month, I knew. Yeah. I knew it was coming up close. But I was yeah. like, when is this shit dropping? I don't think November fifteenth is going to be. I think they're going to probably cancel it. it. I think they're going to cancel it. They probably will cancel it. I don't see it happening. Yeah, they're so, going to yeah. drag it, soak up a little more money, maybe another month. Of course, because, you know. because if if something serious health wise did happen to him, even a year from now, he's getting older. Yeah, he can't be boxing if he had some sort of severe. Right. Health thing that just happened. What you doctor know? is signing off on this? You know, None. Right? The yeah. people that want to make money, and it's just like at this point, <coughs> it's no shade to Mike. It's just he's a great fighter, but if you're at that point where you're not going to fight no more, it's no okay. I mean, mm -hmm. there'll be others. Yeah, you yeah. know. I mean, he's he's not broke either. I mean, I know he's he, not broken, he but he went broke, but he got back. Yeah, he's, I think he's got. He's, a, oh, you mean financially? Right. Yeah. 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 Oh, I think he meant after broken. Robin Givens divorced him. Yeah, took all oh, yeah. his shit. I think I think if he went and died in the ring, he'd be really throwing away actually a decent career. Nah, I rather I rather see him just keep holding up his old championships. Like, right. it, what to just go and shut a young kid up for what? Let That's him have the spotlight. Nah. Let him, let him. You would, you would took that fight. Them, them, them paws need hands on them. Oh man, no, come on, man. Jake Paul is the one that. Like, Jake Paul, I do like Jake Paul though. Yeah. Logan's the one that really needs hands. Is that which one is uh, which? Who's the youngest one? Jake is the I youngest one, right? Uh, yeah, yeah. Jake, Jake, Jake. Jake. Okay, Jake's Jake is the one, one whooping everybody's ass, right? Yeah, he's the one yeah, that's tatted yeah. up too. Okay, okay. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Logan. Logan's the entertainer. He's the one that's <laughs> in like wrestling or doing exactly. WWE shit. Or exactly. Something? Yep. Yep. Okay. Yeah. But he's the one that initiated uh, going after Mike. Like he's the one that was like, "Hey," or was it like all orchestrated? Like yeah. how did that shit even come about? I really don't know. Because they both, 
Jake has like a boxing promotion company. Yeah. So like yeah. they brought the deal to him and then they okay. then they brought it to Netflix. Or they brought it to Netflix first. Mm. They struck up a deal with Netflix and then they closed on the boxer, which was okay. Mike Tyson. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah. Cause this fight was going to was going to Netflix. Mm -hmm. Yeah, which so that's was gonna, I was which like, is going to be crazy. I was yeah. checking Netflix. I was and I'm like, I don't see it. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I which, was excited. Yeah, which yeah. was crazy because literally all of us were going to be able to watch it. Right. Yeah. But I feel like these legacy fights haven't been all that great. <clears throat> the one that Mike Tyson fought. Who did he Who's fight the last time? Um, Who's that last nigga Mike Roy Tyson Jones? fought? It was Roy nigga, Jones. That shit was kind of crazy. Yeah, Roy yeah. Jones. Yeah. That, that, that one wasn't bad, but that was a minute ago. Yeah. yeah, but they was throwing hands. Yeah, they were. Yeah. Roy Joyce has a whole like single to that shit, man. Right? Yeah, I can't be rocked. I can't be mm -hmm. boo. <laughs> Roy Joyce just yeah, crazy yeah, yeah. intros. Joyce had, a, yeah. had a mean single, right? Yeah, yeah, them niggas was throwing hands at that fight. At yeah. that fight, yeah. How many leg legacy fights have there been? Because been the, the only this is the one with Jake Paul. This is the only recent one, unless I can't remember. Didn't uh, didn't Holyfield come back and do one? I, I think already. he did. And then um, to fight somebody in oh, his wait, own Holyfield? class? Holyfield? No, Holyfield. Or, uh, no. Wait. I don't think Holyfield ever returned in, did he? I, th I feel like he did a return fight. And it was like a big deal. He's selling grills. Nowadays. No, 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 no. no, 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 no you know, hold on, hold on, you think Oh, that's right. Yeah, hold on, that's right. But, but when he said Holyfield. <laughs> ball, ball heads got me. Yeah, but yeah, when yeah, he yeah. said Holyfield, I thought George Foreman too. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. <laughs> nah. George, George Foreman's like 80. Oh, yeah, we're talking about year. Yeah, that nigga's old. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, 2021. That's what I thought. Oh, wow. came back. I totally missed that. Serves as a warning for Mike Tyson. Dude, how old is Evander Holyfield? Mm. I don't know. He think, still looks good, though. I think. 61. 61. Yeah, he, got, he still got a six pack. He was fighting at 57. Yeah. Or what is that? Yeah, yeah what's the math? Yeah, 57? 58. That's insane. Yeah, that is 58. 58. Yeah, That's yeah. Hey, no way. No way your doctor's like, yeah, you can go take some, a few padded blows to the head I mean, over there, like it's 61. Well, do we got a uh, visual on that fight? Was he getting tagged like that in that fight? Yep. He was. Oh, look oh, at the, look at this one. This, this sums it up. His, based on his picture. Yeah, that's pretty much sums it up. <laughs> oh wow! That's yeah. the first picture that pops up. <laughs> yeah, based on this picture, look, like he, <laughs> look at the ref. Look yo. like he took an L, nigga. <laughs> nigga said, this looks like he's waiting right yeah. now. He said, "Chill, chill, chill, chill." He can't. He that's can't. his doctor. Yeah, 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 yeah. The yeah, referee. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> referee, let, yeah, let that's him catch That's your first picture, nigga. That's the highlights. Yeah, yeah. The highlights are probably not favorable. It's time to hang up those gloves. If I Google your name and that's what I see, oh my god. Bryson Tiller's coming to town. This is random, but I was just mm -hmm. just yeah. thinking about. I was thinking uh, the game is also game two is also tonight too. Yes, it is. Wait, where? Game two, the NBA finals. NBA finals. Oh, uh, NBA finals. Oh, yeah. Celtics versus the Cavs. Uh, yeah. The Cavs. You know, the yeah. Mavs. Mavs. Mm -hmm. Who plays yeah. on the Mavs nowadays? Kyrie, Luka Doncic. Luka Doncic's nice man. Kyrie's kind of been off though for like the last. Or I don't know. I didn't watch the, last series. He was on fire, fire, but, but this first but game, game one not. It was not. Mm -hmm. Yeah, mm -hmm. they got blown out low key. They, they had did. well, they had they, they had his number, man. That's all. They just had him dialed in. They yeah. Were, so yeah, this game he got to turn up on this game. Hell yeah! Is Kyrie the new star? Is LeBron still like? Clean the house in the NBA? He's not in the finals. Nah, hell no. Nah. Yeah, he's still not the star. Really? Ky Ky Kyrie's in the finals. Not Damn. Damn. Did LeBron yeah. ever get his sixth ring? Hell no. He yeah. got, what is he at four? He's at four. Yeah. four. He at four? He's at four. What does yeah. uh, MJ got? Six. Six. Mm. Oh, so he's missing two? Damn. Kobe, Kobe, six. Nah, Kobe don't got six. Five? I think Kobe got four, too. Let is me Kobe double check. Four? It might four, four or five. Let me see. I know Phil Jackson got the most. Yeah. <laughs> That's that, facts. That nigga got like eight. Yeah, yeah. yeah Kobe <laughs> got five. Kobe got five. Yeah, that's what I thought. And then uh, how many does Phil Jackson got? Uh, like 11. No, I don't know. Let me see. That Phil Jackson shit is crazy. <laughs> There's no he, documentary. He, he, he yeah. can put one on every hand. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. And then some Anato. There's no documentary about uh, Kobe. Is there a championship? Not yet. Okay. It's got to be coming at some point. Because 2020 but. was his passing. You know, yep. so I figured yeah. like you know, maybe a, a couple it's, of years it later. Do, it still does yeah, feel. he's got eleven, it, I believe. Some kind of legacy. It still does feel too early. Four years. Too early? Um, too soon. But you know what's funny? Mm. Because Will Smith is going around promoting um for bad boys right now. Mm -hmm. I thought about his documentary. Will? Yeah. Yeah. Oh like if he would have one? Like he's gotta have one. It's Will Smith, you know? But at the same time it's He has to. He has to he by has now, to. right? But not by now Maybe. because he's not done. <clears throat> right. The That's saga's true. not over. Yeah. That's true. And on top of that, think about the fact that the slap has to be in the movie. Yeah. Oh, my God. Like, so that was the biggest thing that I was thinking about. I guess so like, going to address it. He's doing all these interviews and stuff like that, and nobody's asking him about the slap. Yeah. It's just like, it's a point. He's so big up. Yeah. He dealt with it. And he's such a superstar. You give him the respect of not asking that question. No. 
I, I wouldn't ask him either. Because, yeah, first of all, I'm I guess over it. no point. Yeah, I'm, I'm over it. Like, We're all it, over it, it anyway. Like, yeah. it just wasn't even that serious to start with. He fessed up to it. Like, it's like, just right. let's, ju- let's just move on. Right. Yeah. So, uh, but, but yeah, but the movie has to have that moment. Yeah. See, like okay. what I was thinking, I was like, <laughs> you know, that everybody always like focused just on the slap, right? Yeah. But I was just like, you know, that whole slap situation when it was going down was so interesting to me that I was like, you know, you could possibly make like. Uh, a limited series about this one slap. Absolutely. Because of the three players involved. Yeah, facts. Because to me, what was interesting was not the slap itself. It was everything leading up to the slap. The soap opera that was before exactly. it led up to that. Yeah. I know what you mean. You know, like episode one is just about Will Smith and his uh, father. You know, because he saw his father oh, right. get beat oh, wow. up by okay, his... Okay, so look. Oh, yeah, you're going to need yeah, like yeah, a 10-part yeah. series, you, It's funny that you said that because yeah. that's exactly how I was thinking and what had me confused yeah. is how much do you lead up to the movie? How much yeah. of that backstory do we get That's in, the, yeah. in the biopic? Yeah. Right? Yeah. Because this is unfortunately probably his biggest moment outside his of- Biggest mistake. His yeah. biggest mistake in this Trump, this is up there with Independence Day. You know what I mean? Like, yeah, yeah. So it's <laughs> like, it's up there with his biggest blockbusters. Yeah. This moment, it can't be grazed over. Yeah. Not sure. He also has a certain level of pressure behind him now because even though he won the uh, actor award that he's always wanted, mm. you can't now you can't end your career on that high. Yeah. It's yeah. like I feel like yeah. he feels like he has to work now for another 20 years. He has to produce now. So that that could be the middle of his life. <laughs> oh, I yeah, you're right. You know, does yeah. that make sense? The yeah. middle of his career. The yeah, middle not, of his not career. The end of be, his career. Yeah, because even if he only does five more movies, that's not enough to wash out. Wait, huh? the slap. I get what you're saying. You see what I'm saying? He's got to yeah. do. Uh, he's got to do like Robert Downey Jr. Almost where like. Yeah, yeah. Uh, he had, like, I don't know. Look, I love Will. He will yeah. always be. Yeah, I'm, I'm glad we're getting him back. Has anybody? I'm glad seen... we're getting him back. Hey, me too. Has anybody seen the new Bad Boys? Mm-hmm. Uh, no, I haven't. Well, it's seen not it. out. Is it out? Is it out? It's out. It's out. It's out. Heard good things so far. Came out Friday. I did. I heard good things about it too. Yeah. Because we were busy yesterday, and then so and then. I might if I'm off on Tuesday, I might go watch two movies. Maybe during the week. Because I still want to see Lord of the not Lord of the Rings. Uh, uh, Planet of the Apes. Oh yeah. And then I want to see um, Bad Boys. The Bad Boys. Mm -hmm. Planet of the Apes. Not not for life because I keep for life. That was the third one. (laughs) Yeah, I might do a double. I might be. I might do a double feature on Tuesday. (laughs) That's 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 nice. I do like doing that. You do like a do like a lunchtime movie or like a mid morning, like eleven a.m. Just go dolo. Yeah, that's good. Then and then like you know leave, do my thing, come back at like eight. Yeah. yeah, or seven or something like that's, that. That's the way to do it. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. yeah. But you're right about that Will Smith thing, though. I feel like he he is gonna have to go fairly longer in his career, but right. he can transition into like roles that like Sean Connery took. You know, shit like that. Uh, yeah. Like yeah. you know okay. what I'm saying? Yeah. Like yeah. old old uh, mm-hmm. spy shit later on because he does yeah. the action shit pretty well. Yeah, of course. He's and like After trip. Earth wasn't a bad movie. Oh, on on my part, I mean, mm-hmm. it wasn't like. A box office movie, I'm but say, his I acting think, in that was still good to me. I'm about to say, I his think, personal, I think, I think niggas hated that movie. <laughs> yeah, a lot of people did. A lot of people yeah, 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 did, but I, I was a yeah, fan. A lot of people say Jaden, Jaden killed it. I think it's weird to say. I think Jaden. But people, I, were, I think people were pissed. Uh, not pissed, but people were just like the, the whole Nepo thing. You gotcha. know, like right. was sort I didn't of like even watch it. I don't, and that was M Night Shyamalan too. Okay, but nobody cared in pursuit of happiness. That shit was good. That, that is my. F- that was a good movie. Is that my favorite? That made me cry. Good movie. Oh no, what was that? Seven yeah. pounds made me cry. That was Both, but similar vibes, but yeah, yeah similar yeah, vibes. Yeah. yeah, yeah, but or maybe I would say I don't know if it's my favorite, but I'll say that Pursuit of Happiness is one of his greatest performances. Yeah, and we did with just that, that speech that he gives to his son at the gate. That's it. Yeah, about yeah, you know yeah. never let somebody tell you to, and just that ending when he finally gets a job. Yeah, that oh face. Oh my god! And then, I was he happy, so clap, happy, and then walks past the actual dude. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. walks past the dude, and just the way he was clapping in the street, yeah, yeah. crying his, while clapping and smiling. At that the is time. one of his greatest performances. I, 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 I remember seeing that shit. People probably won't agree, but uh, mm. I really like. Him in that focus movie because it's a it's a slept focus. Movie I haven't seen it. yeah, yeah it's that one where gone. he did the uh, thievering shit. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I never saw that. He one. Margot Robbie. Yeah. Like Mar- yeah, he was like a thief. Oh, and that was my, yeah. I saw that. I saw that recently. Actually, yeah. it was oh, pretty did. straight. Yeah. Actually, and yeah, I, yeah, I, I like good. him. That's why I thought about the spy shit. I was like, why mm-hmm. don't you do more, more roles yeah, like this? I've I can see seen, him doing that. I've only seen that movie Personally. once, and it was real recent. Yeah, I might have even caught it like thirty minutes late, but it was good. It was straight. I watched it from where it was. Yeah, I watched it from where it was. Yeah. What was that spy joint that he did? Um, in like the late 90s or maybe early Enemy 2000s. of the State. Enemy of the State. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. that was good. That, that was, was fire. Good. I like that movie. Yeah, yeah. yeah if they need a new James Bond, Will Smith can fill that role. I kind of want to. Now, like, movies. I, I James Bond movies. Idris. 
He's British already. No, no, both of them. Are t- like I, the, oh, I heard Scottish. that they're going for somebody in their thirties. Oh really? Okay. Gotcha. Yeah, yeah. You know, because uh, even Craig, uh, what's his name? Lord, Daniel please Craig give was it to too anybody old. but Michael B. Jordan. Lord <laughs> Jesus. And he's not. Hey, look, Lord he's not Jesus. British. I was like, gonna say, yeah. like British actors who are British. Oh, yeah. so it's always been a British actor? Oh, really? Yeah, it's a British uh, franchise. He's he's supposed. Oh, to, uh, yeah, I never knew that. It's not an American yeah, but, franchise. But but Bond in the in the storyline, he's actually Scottish. Oh, is he? Yeah, he's supposed to be Scottish. Well, oh, then oh, we've oh, been sure. culture vulture and everything. We need a Scottish. Yeah, I guess I didn't yeah. think. I guess I didn't think that James Bond was English. Bond. I just James never, Bond. Yeah, I never. I just never thought about Bond. it. But yeah, everybody do have English accents right. in that bitch. Yeah, yeah. yeah. you're always because well, at least the bosses do. He's stuff. not for the CIA. He's for the um. Yeah. Damn, what's the British? The uh, Interpol. Mi six. Mi six. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like in all the movies, they have the British flag in in the back. It takes place. I was slipping on the. Yeah. The imagery, uh, yeah, yeah, I just, yeah, yeah, it just slipped my mind. I didn't even think about that shit. Well, I mean, because then it could be kind of confusing too, because Mission Impossible is sort of like the James Bond of American James Bond. Exactly, kind of, yeah. that is American James and Bond. They, they could look similar sometimes. They always like driving through Venice, it really spa- speed chasing right, and shit through these narrow places you in foreign countries. I had pushback, I, but you're right. Yeah, I haven't seen. I don't think I've seen all of the. I might have seen one Mission Impossible. There's a lot of them. Which one was it? I don't even remember which so one it was. Like, you know what? I, I can't blame you because it they, wasn't they a new be one. Similar. Yeah, yeah, it wasn't yeah. a new one. It was definitely one of the older ones, but yeah. it's like four, right? Yeah, no. five. There's at least like, like there's six, six or seven. seven. Yeah, there's like the, holy yeah. shit. Let me see. The first I've one came like out two. when I was in when I was twelve. I've seen like three of them. I've yeah. seen at least two. I'm pretty sure I haven't I've seen, seen more. All I don't of think them. I've seen more than one. First you one, the one with that actress. I forget that girl. He had the motorcycle. Oh man, I wish I knew who she was. She played in Chronicles of the Riddick. She oh, was, I uh, think I know who you're talking about. Yeah, not Michelle sure. Rodriguez. Oh, they got one coming out in um, 2025. I have oh, seen so. those trailers. Yeah, which is uh, connected to the last one. Late season. One is about there's to drop. Six, yeah, so there's currently seven, six out or oh, seven six. out. There's Gosh. currently seven out. Oh, so seven out. number yeah. eight is dropping. Yep, yeah, number yeah, eight is dropping next year. Oh, it's like ta- Fast and the Furious, man. They're taking it to ten. Yeah, for sure. yeah, that's pretty much what they're doing here. Yeah, yeah. taking it to ten. And you know they have they have quintessential scenes they have to have in every single one where he's they have to have a scene where he's sprinting. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, they oh have. yeah! Oh, and and that's that's even beyond the mission. He's think, running in every movie. Yeah, that's oh, him. you're right. He does sprint. He is sprinting every movie. Yeah, that's, he likes that's the, part of his clause. Wait, yeah. did, he, did he sprint in Top Gun? Of course. In the latest one. Down oh, the beach. maybe that could be know. an exception. That could I be an exception because he was, was in the plane. So, so maybe not. Oh yeah. Oh, that's true. In he's that, in that in whack ass volleyball scene, he, he probably did sprint in that scene. You talking about you talking about Top Top Gun Maverick, right? He's in both. I mean, the, the yeah, Top Gun and Top Gun. Yeah, yeah. The, yeah. the one where that new actor is like taking over what Tom Cruise played on the previous Top Gun. Right. Exactly. Yeah. Didn't, yeah, they, didn't they literally call him Goose again and shit? They did. He well, that was it. Goose's son. That was Goose's son. Okay, yeah. got you. Okay. He definitely ran in that movie. I heard yeah. it was lit. I never saw it. Oh, you know lit. what? Lit. Maybe he did because there's a part where they're playing crashes in some snowy place and they both have to run somewhere. So I'm yeah. sure he had to <laughs> do his sprint. <laughs> yeah. He probably ran faster than the kid. But um, yeah, what were we saying right before the Mission Impossible? Will Smith. Will Smith. Oh, yeah. So, um, yeah, I think my favorite from him um, is performance is uh, Pursuit of Happiness. But my favorite movie has probably been in black. Yes, Men okay. in Black. Yeah, swag. I am at. It's so the funny, one. man. Yeah, the, one, really the, the one liners on Men in Black are crazy. Is that, you dragging the table? <laughs> you want to yeah, get down yeah. on this? The script in that first one <laughs> yeah. is, Telling you. is serious. You're like, yo, yeah. who, who, put the, who put them rats up? Who put them rats in my locker, okay? Yeah. <laughs> it just be raining black people in New York. <laughs> <laughs> that That's, first, that one, first one really was hilarious. <laughs> yeah. It was good. Yeah. I'm always like a first um, movie guy because I, I like prefer. The first is the one that resonates the most. I like Bad Boys 2. Um, part two uh, yeah. because it's so funny, yeah. but but I prefer Bad Boys one because just seeing that the chemistry between him and Martin for the first time was yeah you know it was such a magical thing you know and okay. honestly that, that first one they were still modest middle class yeah yeah they were, like, yeah, they were, they yeah. were upper middle class Let's they weren't out here yeah. costing the city but like by, billions of dollars trying by, to catch like, oh, okay yeah you're but right, by, you're but right. But even that even even the way will lived was clearly a trust fund baby but it mm. wasn't nearly as flashy as two movie two and yeah on, he was sure. a lot yeah, more sure. humble in one yeah it was more humble but he still had a nice car and He's things still like a ladies that. man yeah. still a ladies man but yeah from movie two these niggas got he turned up even even martin it was like his house got nice on the water. It was he like was, yeah, yeah. he wasn't flashy, but that nigga, you could tell he was doing very well though. Still, yeah. didn't like a cop salary. I tell you that much. Yeah, Which, the first movie they had a, a, a elevated cop salary. Right. Yeah. It was real. It was real realistic. You yeah. know what I'm saying? And even Michael Bay himself, like maybe I like the first one too because it was sort of like 
Michael Bay didn't go full Michael Bay just yet. Like, if you were watching the first almost. one, you you can barely tell it's a Michael Bay movie. Young yeah. Michael Bay was different from, from, from you know, more modern Michael Bay. Yeah, right, right I think, like, after Armageddon, right. that's when, he, like, his budgets went up. That's when his spectacles really went up, yeah. you know? Because, like, yeah. after Armageddon, that's when we got um, Bad Boys 2, you know? Gotcha. So Bad Boys 2 was, like, super glossy looking compared to the first one. A lot of explosions. That's yeah. true. He did have that thing where... Um, objects would reflect looking. against the risk. Uh, the, the, so that was this thing where, like in Transformers, they had a whole bunch of scenes where something would like shine <laughs> against the the camera lens. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's yeah, super yeah. saturated. And everybody looks sweaty. Mm, yeah, <laughs> right. I don't know why. Oh, the you're right. The Transformers movies. Yeah, everybody Megan looks Fox sweaty. Look wet all the time. <laughs> That's true. Yeah. That is an excellent point. I didn't think about that. It did, wow. look, gr it did look gringy like that. Yeah, the whole time. yeah. I kind of like that shit. Yeah, I mean that's his style. I mean, because yeah. uh, th that's how I know I'm watching. Like, I at least know I'm watching the Michael Bay movies. Just like his cinematography always looked like that. Explosions. Yeah. Yo, uh, speaking of still film and stuff like that, mm -hmm. let's transition over into. Uh, I have to talk about this and just get this off my chest. Insecure. Yeah. Okay, yeah. So, yeah. Insecure, I'm late to the party, obviously. There's like five or six seasons to Insecure. And I dropped yeah. off. Um, but it's actually just on, it's on Netflix now. Okay. And same with like Atlanta. I was late to Atlanta as well. I mm. finally watched all oh, of Atlanta. Man. Yeah. Phenomenal. And yeah. then I just finally got to Insecure. Okay. I don't know why I was like lollygagging. I'm on season three. Yeah. Bro, that show is so good. Oh, shit. Okay, maybe I got to do that. That show is so <laughs> Good. Yeah. The script, nigga. Yeah. <laughs> it's yeah. so real. Yeah. It's like, not only is it so real, it's also a perspective that I can only assume, but I'd never, I haven't witnessed all of these aspects of like this girl, this uh, black girl's friend group, her at her, her late 20s, early 30s, like working, has a job that's like pays the bills, barely scrapes by. One of her friends is a lawyer. Yeah. Almost on some girlfriend shit, but it's like she's nerdy. She or like living her. single. Yeah, yeah she okay. raps to herself. She's got a boyfriend that she's been with for a little while. Yeah, All the relationships, even outside of Issa wrote the story. Mm -hmm. Her character is obviously the strongest. Yeah. But even the other characters are developed out so well. Yeah. Like, okay. So her, it's like her it's black lady entourage. Yeah, her boyfriend's friend group. Mm -hmm. You're like, this is a nigga friend group. Yeah. <laughs> you're like, period. Yeah. Like, you know what I mean? Like, yeah. you're like, oh, you find you you recognize every person in the friend group immediately. Yeah. Nigga, it's flushed. These characters are so flushed, nigga. Yeah. Do you think oh no no no? Cause I mean, like, if it's a show, you think she probably has like a writer's room, right? Probably. Probably. Uh, yeah, so no, maybe no, she no, has like no, because that yeah, that was gonna be my question, you know, because I I was going from the perspective she was writing it like every episode herself yeah. but if she has like a, a writer's room because i was going to ask you like were the men written well because i was going to say oh, do yes. you think she's just like that or it was like oh maybe she has men in the writer's room to like Possibly. put their two cents in and be like no, no no maybe he should say this and it Possibly. seems it seems if realistic she was, if she was writing the men and the women nigga, yeah. she is she knows right. men <laughs> god yeah. damn you know what i'm yeah. saying <laughs> i don't 100 percent know but yeah. yeah yeah either way whoever was behind that and i know she writes a, a bulk oh of yeah the yeah i know she mm -hmm. writes a bulk of the shows anyway mm -hmm. um yeah it's based off her comedy or whatever I guess. yeah can you search her this youtube for page Matt? um no, no. go yeah. to uh youtube and search insecure yeah it started from her uh what, awkward black girl yeah i've never watched the actual show but i've seen a bunch of viral clips from it they, right. they have a lot of clips bro, they're so, mm -hmm. it's so but, funny yeah. um Okay, this song. I remember that Insecure song for yeah. Insecure. Yeah. Uh, let's see. Let me think of a. I want to do one of the friend group. Do um, Lawrence Open House. Uh, scroll down. Or do. Scroll down a little bit more. Keep going. All right, go back up. Do. What, was one of those Lawrence Condo? Hmm. Go, no, go back to the search. Go back. <laughs> Broken pussy rap. That's yeah. Condola. The condola? Who the fuck is Condola? I don't know. Click on it. Let me see. Maybe I just forgot somebody's name. Okay. Go back on screen and click condola that first. And it's okay. Uh, go up to the top. Click this. So there, uh, just so you can get a little bit of this, just a mm -hmm. taste of this interaction. So what mm -hmm. happened was, uh, she cheated. He found out. Somebody hasn't been home for a couple of days. They live together. Mm -hmm. And then he fucks around and goes to CVS and sees her in the CVS. And she and you haven't even been home in like three days. Gotcha. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. After we had this big argument. Yeah. So this is just how real the fucking mm -hmm. interactions be. 
Issa, where have you been, huh? Oh, I, I... Are you not coming home? I just want to up the quality oh, of things that I'm... God damn it. Yeah, Good yeah, trailer. it was a, like a recap. Fuck, sorry. Yeah, <laughs> sorry. Um, go down. I could type in, are you coming home? But... Nah, nah, don't worry about it. Yeah. Damn, I... I wonder what this, brother. This, yeah, I can't think of one specifically, but this nigga's really friend, bro. This is uh, put Lawrence and friends, bro. This light skinned nigga is fucking hilarious, bro. That nigga <laughs> is. Hol What's his name? Go. Yeah, what is uh, it? Chad. Chad, the ultimate, ultimate wingman. wingman. Yeah, is this a compilation? Uh, I believe so. It yeah, might so be. Click, click that. Or maybe they're talking about it. Nigga, this nigga. This is that. He is hilarious, my nigga. This might be a compilation. Oh, yeah, this is perfect. Oh, so you're talking about all the names. I still got some time. Hey, I'm getting married, man. <laughs> Shut the fuck up, man. No, for real, it's time. Lee, is it, bro? Wow. You know how long y'all on each other? Not that long. It's crazy, though, man. <laughs> but the one day I'm getting the girl a deal on the law. Next, I'm getting engaged, moving into that law, and realizing it has some real structural problems. Oh, bitch, let the bitch read. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he's blowing up the bed. <laughs> <clears throat> My bad. I saw some spots today. You find something? Nah, not yet. Go give me a few weeks, though. I'll be out. Hey, you gonna move back in with no girl? <laughs> <laughs> Relax, man. I'm fucking with you. What, you going to sleep already? I'm tired, man. All that fucking, huh? I know you had it in you, bro. Good for you. <laughs> what you mean? You got your new shit down to a science. Roll in on Friday, smash all weekend, bounce out on Sunday. There's no maintenance sufficient. All upside. It's not even like that. She's cool. You don't even take the bitch out. You know how much money I spent on Leah? Call napkins and shit. No, you don't know what you're talking about. All right? We're both having fun. No pressure. <laughs> hmm? Pressure bus pipe. <laughs> shit. Bro, yeah, no, that's this, nigga, great. this nigga, yeah. this nigga's hilarious, yeah. bro. Holy, every time he, every time movie. he gets on, and he talks fast, fast, yeah, he's yeah, an he asshole, like, but he's he got good looking at you. But he go, yeah. but he gonna keep it real though. Yeah, you know what yeah. I'm saying? But yeah. his, his whole friend group, I'm like, bro, this show is, this show's good because even though the main character is a woman, it doesn't mm -hmm. matter because yeah. it's like that character is good too, bro. And Issa's like a nerdy black girl too, mm -hmm. so yeah, like yeah. she's awkward, yeah, awkward, yeah, awkward yeah, is the, awkward is the best way to do it. So like. She likes to rap and shit like that. In the mirror. So yeah. like, yeah, she'll rap in the mirror, but it'll also just happen mid scene. Like right. mm, something, something there's like a, a serious moment. You're like, oh shit, she's got to have uh, this conversation with the dude. Yeah. And then it'll be like a, a situation played out and she'll be like rapping and shit. Yeah. It, it'd be a flashback to what she got going on in her head or something. Oh yeah. Oh, yeah. Is yeah. it one of those shows where she, they have scenes where she imagines something happened. She imagines someone's response to something and that wasn't that the real too. response. Okay. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. She those either, she fun, either man. dreams forward or does a dream break and does a rap. Oh, oh okay. yeah. yo, 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 you seen the clip where I don't I don't know the context of it, but she's just laughing hysterically and just like kicking people in the chest. Have you yes. What? I saw that, that clip is funny yeah, as I hell. Saw that. <laughs> that shit. I, I have no idea what the context is, Bro, but I know I've seen that clip. She's funny as hell, and it's just mm -hmm. like, yeah, we definitely need more shows like this. Oh, yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> and like, uh, <laughs> oh, bless you. Thanks. Um, Sorry, y'all. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, you did it right into the mic? Yeah, yeah. I mean, <laughs> I cover my face, but... It's your mic. Yeah, but you, it's definitely your mic today. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's it. Still that same cat, man. <laughs> yeah. Um, but yeah, so it's like... Um, that's why, like, with hers, like, I felt... Oh, no, no. I was going to say, like, the, the her and her guy. I One of one of the things when I st stopped watching, I always used to hear about, I guess, black women mostly, like, talking about, like, the the debating her relationship with the guy uh, and some of them you know just debating on whose side you're on or something like that right. uh since you're into season three have you like picked a side in terms of the characters of like like is she she in the wrong or is he in the wrong or like, because i don't know who she cheated with and, and all that shit i don't know if it was she's emotional only, or just sexual she's only in the wrong because physically she stepped out first not emotionally just physically. i guess emotionally comes first anyway, yeah, you know, yeah. I guess, before she step, physically steps out. Yeah. Well, maybe not all the time, but yeah, I don't know. Oh. <laughs> I don't know, but she physically stepped out first, so I guess yeah. she'd be in the wrong. Yeah. But at the same time, he's in the wrong too because he was uh, unemployed for two years living uh, off his girl. Okay. 
trying to get a startup business going and not getting a job and shit. So it's like, I mean, are we really that upset that your bitch cheat on you? Because yeah. it's yeah, like, yeah, yeah. I mean... Maybe that's she, what the debate is. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? She's supporting him. Or was, yeah. I mean, I guess at a certain point, too, I think what's interesting, actually, is... I say... Let's say for the first eight months, like, your girl's holding you down, paying the bills and stuff like that as you pursue your dream. But year two rolls around, and almost at the end of year two, mm-hmm. she's not, she can't even support for real. Yeah, she, yeah there's because, no way she can see it into that. Because now she don't see the end, and yeah. now she's just, like, paying, and it's just weighing on her. She fucked up. We're mm-hmm. struggling off of my one salary. Mm-hmm. When you could get a job and do this at the same time, you yeah, know what I mean? Yeah, like, yeah. So yeah, it's it's a little bit of both, but it's, bro, no, it was yeah, such no, an yeah. accurate re- relationship because okay, he was a bum nigga for two years. Mm-hmm. She stepped out and cheated once, and then it was a fling. Yeah. Then he got a job. He was like, "Fuck it, I just gotta go. I'll go back to the basics." Went got a job at Best Buy. You oh, know what I, mean? I saw that. Okay, yeah, so maybe so, I, I dipped in and out. Yeah, okay, so then I now see, he, see gets, he was at Best yeah, Buy. now he gets a job at Best Buy. Then he got an office job. But he was like, but I remember like from what I saw, he was kind of like rubbing it in her face or something, or 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 kind of yeah, like yeah. So you know, what happened like was shit. yeah. Then it was became this tit for tat thing. So yeah, where it was like the way she even told him about it, and then the way she was acting about it would make a nigga go crazy. Mm. And then uh, he was like, well, I'm gonna do my thing, and since she fucked that nigga. He set it up to where he fucked the chick that's from yeah. the bank yeah, he ch- in their apartment. Oh, yeah. somebody that she interacts with on a regular basis. Yeah, it was. Yeah, it, it was, was like a, <laughs> it's a savage back and forth. It's some yeah, shit it was like petty shit going. Bro, it's some shit people in relationship for real. <laughs> yeah, that dude, happened in real life. Yeah, to where it's like even me as an outsider watching it, I'm like, I can't call. This who, is happening next door. I can't call who's right or wrong because this okay. is yeah. y'all in war. I mean, you're, right look, now. you're looking yeah. objectively. <laughs> yeah, yeah, and it's like. Yeah, he started it. She did something. Let's that see point, where this goes. Because yeah. yeah. I'm, I'm the fly in the wall. Yeah, so right. At this point, nigga, it's up. For, it's up at this point. That's like true. if one of my homeboys was going through this too, yeah. it'd be like, damn, bro, I don't know what to do. It's yeah. like at this point, we need to figure out: Do you really want to stay? Yeah. Or do we just need to get the fuck up out of here? Because it's yeah, only the, the, the back man. and forth is only going to continue if you stay. If you can't get over it, or vice versa. Right. Yeah. So yeah, it's it was a lot going on. Which is what his friend is basically saying to him, right? Yeah. Like like basically, hey, what are you going to do? Yeah. 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 Because at that point, yeah. he had fully moved out. He's sleeping on his homie's floor. Yeah. Well, so there's like this transition period where they finally fully break up and move away from each other. Yeah. And then we're, now we're watching them kind of rebuild their lives as individuals now. Because mm-hmm. they've been living together for the last two years. Yeah. So you're in season three. So how many seasons are there? I think there's five or six five, total. Or yeah. On Netflix. Like yeah. Okay. It's, it's amazing. It really yeah. is amazing. Yeah. It's, it's, and I'm also liking this whole thing of like, uh, maybe we're just going back to how cable was, where you don't have to get these separate things in order to watch stuff. Like now, all the HBO—not all, but but some of the HBO stuff is just coming to other platforms, like oh, uh, in fact, uh, like yeah, like like uh, Netflix. Yeah, you know? yeah, yeah, yeah. Because I mean, even like a lot of DC stuff is now on Netflix. So if I want to watch The Dark Knight, it's on Netflix. Is there another season coming out, F Mac? Can you see if there's a season coming out? Insecure. Remember or when did we they remember when we talked about her complaining about. Her complaining to uh, the contract that about she got. the contract in HBO yeah. or something like yeah. that. Yeah, she was complaining about something. They yeah. low-ball, uh, they low-balled her, and then she made a whole thing so, about yeah. women's pay and uh, yeah, yeah, script. yeah. I think I saw that. So and it's like maybe we had. I remember. I remember saying that maybe we just have to wait for her to get out of whatever the deal is, so that she can fund her own projects and right. get her own studios, which Six, eight, nobody she can like definitely was, do. Looks yeah. like it was supposed to only have five seasons. Gotcha. Oh, okay, yeah. it's a good number. Cause it was it was a complete it was a whole story that she wrote and that was just you know they 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 ran the course. What else has Issa written? Written, uh, like uh, narratively, like like yeah. another yeah, show. Yeah, like what? Is, oh, what, what, did what she do something called like the shy rap shit? She did the shy. Did she? Wait, was that the shy? No, no, no that was Lena Waithe. Lena Waithe. Wait, yeah, Wait, yeah, that was the yeah. chick from uh, yeah. Master of None. Uh, uh, she Aziz. did. She did. I thought it was a yeah, show called Rap Shit on Stars. I don't remember that. I know. I know what rap. I know. I've heard of rap shit, but like. Black girls, like, I don't know if they were trying to be rappers. I'm not sure. I didn't watch either. I thought, I thought Sorry, rap shit was a, uh, like a documentary style, like on some Vice shit. Mm, I'm not sure. I mean, I really don't know. That is what it sounds like. That. Insecure. Yeah. Oh, oh, no. Oh, she's, n- that's just known Awkward for black it. Girl? Go, go, keep going down. Is that a bar? Yeah. Oh, oh, yeah. The, 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 um, yeah, that was just like what she's known for. This will just right. give us like in order. What okay. she's rap zoom, shit. There zoom we go. F- zoom in Gray F- matter? Hit command and then the plus and minus sign. I think it's number nine and zero. 
It's like it's up there in that area. So all these, all these are things that she's done. Just, yeah. Oh, up yeah. There, up yeah, there in that corner listening. with the plus and minus. From like uh, the first, at the bottom, and then like all the way to the latest. Oh shit! What button is that? What the that, fuck? Whoa! What button was that? What, the what, were, fuck? what were you clicking? Uh, I was hitting nine and zero, but uh, <laughs> you hit the way back. Okay, button. so that goes forward and back. Yeah, I think it's just going slow right now, and it didn't register until. <laughs> oh, okay. I was about to say, nigga, I want to use that. Yeah, that was, <laughs> that was crazy. That was just freaking me out. Yeah, I didn't even know what was like, happening. Yeah, I'm like, nigga, what? What, what was that button? <laughs> Holy shit! Nine and zero. We went right back to that white dude. Yeah. He's like, yeah, you want to see some? <laughs> yeah. No, it went to the very and beginning Carson. of the show. Four chain That's how far back it just clicks. Yeah, yeah it, it was all the it beginning went all of the what way. you looked up. It went to the very first the Google. Yes. That's like the go to the beginning of my day button. Yeah. <laughs> yeah that's that's what happened, which was, was crazy. a happy, happy death day. I thought of. it was one oh, button man. you clicked and it just reversed it. Like that. I was about to say that's crazy. That's the fun. button that, that reminds you how you got into the rabbit hole. Yeah. That you're currently it's like, how did I get on this side? Right, oh, right. well, I'll show you. Like, oh, yeah. Yeah. So I looked up this. It was this first, <laughs> which led to this. Yeah. Oh, yeah. But she. I don't know if she wrote it, but I know that. That she has black girl. Movie. Who's the little black girl that's in the movie Little? Um, little. Yeah, yeah. It was a. a it's a movie where. I, damn, is it uh, Taraji P. Henson is, is a lawyer or something like that, and she regresses to a little girl or something like that, and the okay. little girl is the one that was on Blackish. The little girl that was on Blackish. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, that she stars in the movie Little, and then like, but who was her friend when she was a grown person was Issa Rae. Gotcha. But the little girl, she, I think she came up with that story. And I don't know if she wrote it. I thought that was a remake of like Freaky Friday or something. I don't know if it was a remake, but it's it's that trope. Is that big, um, or big? You know, like yeah, yeah, like when uh, Tom Hanks big. he became a grown boy yeah. and shit. You know, like right. or, or a little boy to a man or whatever. He became this is Tom a lot Hanks. of shit. Yeah. yeah, she's responsible for a lot. Yeah, she's, executive producer. She's a oh, writer, so she, but she was she was a, like she was more of a writer than she is an yeah. actor. Like I think wasn't insecure her crossover into acting kind of more or less. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay. She wrote plays Producers. or something? TV series. Oh, Misadventures of Awkward, Awkward Black, Black Girl. There we go. That Okay, so no, that was, a, of the early that was an internet series. Mm -hmm. That was on YouTube. Yeah, it's a web series. They actually were kind of funny low-key. Mm -hmm. Really? I don't remember Actually, were, they were decently... I don't even they were really short. still... Yeah, they were. They were, oh, they see, were like I five they they broke it up to something. Yeah, they broke it up into like what she's done in acting and what she's done in writing. Mm. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah, because I guess the up there, it was just, oh, executive wow. producer. Ew, it, they were just telling her all the stuff she's produced. Okay. So then this one is, she's acted in 33 stuff. Click on writer, yeah. She's written five stuff. So rap shit. Okay, I had a feeling she wrote It was that. rap shit. Yeah. The core. Rap shit, insecure, the choir, mm -hmm. black Twitter screening, misadventure. Black Twitter black screening. Oh, it's, oh, insecure is up there. Yeah. Yeah, so yeah, so she wrote that. Yeah, her misadventures on YouTube and stuff like that. She, right. Yeah, so 2012, so she wrote that stuff first. So, and I think a lot of the actresses and actors, or at least some of them, I think, were originally in the misadventures of the Aqua. Uh, I, I think some of them yeah. transferred over to Insecure with her. Was Amanda Seals in the. Insecure. In, in it? Okay. She, insecure. She yep. put some people on, man. Yeah. <clears throat> Oh yeah, and oh yeah, because Amanda Seals used to be like on a show when she was a kid. I, I totally forgot. Well, Amanda Seals has been around for a while. Yeah, I had her. no idea. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah it's kind of crazy how much she's, how long she's been around. Wasn't she like a Nickelodeon? Yep, she was Nickelodeon kid, kid. Yeah, yeah. Oh yeah, real quick about Will Smith. What I thought was funny that I, I was going to add on while we were talking about him is that you know he was supposed to be in the Matrix, right? Yes, I heard him talk oh, about, that talk about and, um, it. Yeah, you heard him talk about it, right? Yeah, I heard him so talk about it, yeah, yeah, which but, is kind of crazy. And then it's so funny that his wife ended up being in the second one. Right. Right. <laughs> she damn sure was. Oh, and shout out to Aaliyah. She she was going to be in the second one, too. but She was going to be Jada's role. She was going to be who? Was she going to be Jada's role? She was going to be... Uh, uh, no, she she was going to be some other girl that was in in the movie. She's played by somebody else that I don't know her name. Oh, God. Okay, but okay. I saw when she went to hug... Um, like, like there's footage of her like she shot some days and oh, then, then she died you know mm. um, so they still have the footage floating out there somewhere but when I saw her hug the man that she hugged I was like oh he, she was supposed to be his wife or his mm. girl or whatever but then when I watched the movie uh, it's played by some actress I don't know she gotcha. had a few yeah. projects going on but she died yeah because didn't, didn't she <sighs> we lost a special one I thought she like didn't completely film um, even um, Queen of the Damned she didn't film it. I thought she. I thought she passed. I thought she died before they finished filming it. Oh, and so they had to like, change the ending or something like that. And like, oh, it, she might have it. died. Yeah, she might have died before the movie was released. I thought so. Yeah. yeah. Oh, okay. It was just before it was released. Okay. Yeah. 
man, yeah, man. I, I wish one of my goals is to like make this movie that has a sort of like a Aaliyah love letter in it. Because this guy, it would take place in 2001 before she died. And this high school senior, he has a crush on this girl and she's really into Aaliyah. And that would be like my, I, I would want that to be my sort of love letter to Aaliyah, you know? It's like, kind of like a tribute. Yeah, tribute. yeah, man. Because like when you look at her story and shit, like we really lost like a special one. And she was only 20, she was in her young, early 20s, right? I guess. Yeah. Like I feel like we would have got like a, a rock album from her at some point. Oh man, she would have went all over the place. Yeah, she would have went Neo Soul. She would have went. She would have, yeah, she did all kinds, of, all the features. Can you imagine? Yeah, she was on MTV Movie uh, Movie Award car, red carpet, and uh, when they asked her, "Oh, who are you looking? Uh, who are you uh, looking to see perform tonight?" And I was expecting her to say like fucking Cisco or some shit, and she was like Nine Inch Nails, and I spit out whatever I was drinking because you know, <laughs> for those who know rock music, like Nine Inch Nails is just a dope, dope rock band. I was like, holy shit. I didn't know Did you she fuck was on with that. Red Hot Chili Peppers? Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, for yeah, sure. Yeah, man. Because they're, they're, they're funky. Good band. They're coming here <clears throat> soon. Oh, yeah? I think so. Yeah, yeah. Because they're I was still thinking going. About, I was thinking about going. Yeah, they're yeah. They're crazy, man. Because they're uh, really funky. Yeah, search uh, not, uh, Red Hot Chili Peppers Raleigh. Yeah. Their shows because, are wild. Um, yeah, I've never been. They used to do their Ivan shows. is the reason. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I know yeah. who that is because that's mm. his favorite band. Oh, really? Ivan, yeah. They used to do almost like entire sets with nothing but a sock on. Oh yeah, yeah. Like early, like when yeah. they first came out and shit. Yeah, they probably don't do it. I mean, but I mean, the lead singer is still in great shape for like sixty or however old he is. Are they all? I wonder if they still have the whole. They group. might have left already. Because Flea, uh, dude, Flea. I do know that like, their drummer yeah. is nasty, man. Yeah. North They're Carolina, up. Raleigh. What's that, sir? Oh, that's not Renan. A different guy. Mm, July. Yeah. I hate when they do this. They probably. I thought not they came here. recently. They might. They might have. <laughs> they might. They might have left already. That's yeah. why it's not popping up. Yeah, yeah Bryson we Teller's here. coming to Red Hat, though. Nigga, mm. I might try to sneak Oh, in. nice. Mm. Yeah, those are good shows. I like Red Hat, man. Hey, I was going to say, have you all seen the video of the Red Hot Chili Peppers video directed by Chris Rock? Uh, mm, maybe. I don't know. Uh, what, what's it called? Hump Day Bump. <laughs> and it came out in, like, 2007. He directed it? Yeah, he directed it and starred in the beginning. With him and that black dude. That, who is that black comedian? Uh, he always has a deadpan face and doesn't smile. He's tall and heavy set. Um... God damn it, I can't remember. Black but dude. yeah, if you saw him, you'd be like, oh, that guy. Oh, um, yeah. But yeah, the video starts off because the, the video is about them being at a, a black um, block party. So it's a black par block party and Chris Rock can't get in. And then the music starts playing and then all the black people turn and it's Red Hot Chili Peppers. And he's like, who are these fuck are these red guys? Uh, mm. You know, white guys. Okay. And then in the middle, of the, they just start like jamming and shit because that song is like funky as hell. Hmm. Might have missed them, bro. Yeah, my I bad. I take it back. One. I actually think they are coming out here. June twenty six is looking like. Mm. June okay. June six at the Coastal Credit Union. The the outdoor one. The one where where, where we, we went. Where we saw fifty. Yeah. Nice. We can get lawn again. Yeah. Oh, you can get lawn. Yeah. Because they they got the lawn there, so we can get lawn right. tickets. They probably get them for the low. What is that? Get lawn for ninety eight on here. Huh. Mm, if you went yeah. somewhere else, maybe. You Jesus find Christ. Christ. Vivid seats is crazy. Yeah. That's a lot of people. Yo, Vivid be taxing though. Yeah, they do. But, uh, th okay, they're going to have a bunch of people in that show. I think my, they might be uh, Chris Rock's favorite band because I remember in, I think, Why Did I Get Married? Was it Why Did I Get Married? Oh, no, no, not Why. That's Tyler. Uh, uh, yeah, that's Tyler Perry. What was the other one? I, th I Think I Love My Wife. Yeah. Uh, oh, I, I remember think that movie. Yeah. It's either that or, or his movie Top Five. One of those, he was wearing a Red Hot Chili Peppers shirt. It was, was, a, it was like, a Think My Love My Wife, but I think because she, she introduced him to white people music. Yeah, yeah. And he was uh, saying like, oh, you got nigga ears uh -huh. or something. <laughs> yeah. Mm. Um, but yeah, I remember him, one of those movies, he was wearing like a Red Hot Chili Peppers shirt. I was like, oh, maybe that's why he did that music video. <laughs> hmm. yeah, I need to play some Red Hot Chili Pepper. I need a Greatest Hits album. Yeah, yeah. They, got some, man, they make good music. Oh, oh I mean, that, that's the other thing too. I'm not really like knowledgeable about like their discography me neither. i'm more about their singles and shit so, oh yeah, yeah me I, and i'm pretty sure i know quite a bit of their singles too yeah i'm sure. one of those but i do know i've had like more than one person that like ivan and like mm -hmm. two other my friends where they're like oh i love red hot chili peppers i'm like i gotta check these niggas out you i like the yeah. album californication is good oh yeah that yeah that's like 99 their, okay like in its entirety that's why search that up i feel like i remember seeing what that cover looks like it was real bright and yeah it was like a like psychedelic cool, like almost a, yeah. yeah like a red so pool the, or something california yeah I think, it was a, I think it was like a pool a swimming pool yeah it was a red swimming pool there you the go. images yeah yeah i remember this shit yes. a next door neighbor maybe borrow that album that's a good album man like under the bridge is on that one 
Yeah. Um, yeah. The other side. The other side. Yeah, but but I think a song, yeah, like AJ would like is uh, Humpty Bump, the one that I was talking about with Chris Rock in the video. Mm -hmm. I think you would like that one because it's just so... it Because they, like, I've seen interviews with them talking about their inspirations and shit. Even though they're a rock band, they were influenced by the funk bands of the 70s. Mm, oh, so, for sure. So you can hear, like, uh, fucking George Clinton and right, shit. Right, right, and, right. And the, the guitar is like... The it's, riffs. It's plucking. Yeah, the riffs yeah. are, like, really memorable. The bass is slapping, yeah. <laughs> you know? Um, they one, do a rock good funk. one is like, uh, like, uh, what's what's the actual what's the name of the song? But the, uh, give it away, is that what it's actually? Called? Uh, yeah, give it away. It is yeah. called give, give it away. away. Yeah, okay, that's yeah, that's yeah. really funky too. They, yeah, that one's got a good like. I, yeah, you know what? They could be like maybe maybe that's why he did the video the way it is. But they could be like a good like. If if you're a black person that's not into rock music, if you want like a gateway, yeah. <laughs> like they're like that gateway drug where it's just like okay, ease them in with Red Hot Chili Peppers because gotcha. they're funky. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. And then they'll go from there, maybe to the Foo Fighters. And, what, a, yeah. um, what about Linkin Park? I'll yeah, I love Linkin Park. Love Linkin Park. Yeah, Linkin Park. Yeah. Yeah. Like Park. Yeah, yeah, yeah. High yeah, school. Yeah. One of the members just died, I think. No, no not just died. It was, like, it was a couple of years ago. Like, oh, like 2017 oh, okay, or something. Okay. It was self-inflicted, which is what was so wild. Yeah, so yeah. It was, oh. he offed himself. Um, but yeah, because, I mean, from what I heard, he was, like, really, like... Battling depression and shit? Yes. And he had been for a long time. And had been, yeah, for a long time, but... Yeah, when I was in high school, it was like Linkin Park. You know, that was that whole time when everybody was mixing rock with rap and shit. You know, and Jay Z, they made the and album they, with them. Jay Z, and then, what the like hell Jay, are you like, waiting for? That shit went crazy. Yeah. After this, this should be you no. Know, so for one line. <laughs> I even like the original beat to that song too. Yeah, maybe that'll be my ride out song for the day. Oh yeah, yeah. Some, something from the Black album. Yeah, yeah. I always love that song because it's like it sounds like a. It really sounded like a farewell. That beat. It There's really something did. about that bro, beat. It holy doesn't, shit. doesn't it like make you a little emotion. Like we're never gonna it hear does, from Jay Z again. No, literally, bro. That beat is so. <laughs> There's royal, something about bro. those horns yeah, bro. that's so emotional. I can't put my finger on it. But the song is so upbeat. So that was um. <laughs> wait, that was uh the producer was um. Just oh, Blaze, I have no right? Idea. Just I have Blaze, no I think. Idea. I think it was Just Blaze. Yeah. He was really good at that. Yeah, it just sounds like the last song. <laughs> That was a lore? That wasn't a lore, was it? Is it? Uh, is it? What song was that? Oh, it was called Encore. Encore, Encore that's Encore. right. Okay. Yeah. Matter of fact, I'm down to get into the ride out because I'm playing that first. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let me choose my show. Produced by West for... It was produced by Kanye? No. Can't be, right? Oh, wait, right? It might be. Produced by West. Uh, it does say oh, that. It just says West. Songs released by Rockefeller Records and produced by West. Yep. His name's yeah, in it. So yeah, who other West yeah. can be. Yeah. Like, uh, Kanye was yeah, all over. Yeah, producer was Kanye. Kanye was all over. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah he was. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And Pharrell, too, I think. Because the change clothes can you bring, can you was bring on one? that. Yeah, change and girl, I promise you, no substitute. <laughs> it's just it's me. <laughs> <laughs> um, For everybody that loves yeah. the Thrill Podcast, you know, just so y'all know, this is the Treehouse. Yeah. And, um... I don't know what we would name if you have any questions for us or whatever. Y'all mm. really active in the comments last week, and I don't want to yeah. discourage that. Yeah, yeah. So just leave questions that you want us to answer. This week, we really didn't have any topics. We kind of just was kind of freestyling. Yeah. But that's what the Thrill Podcast is, you know. Pretty sometimes, much. Sometimes, yeah, so. yeah, we kind of just do our own thing. Yeah. We, we, you know, there's structure sometimes, too, mm -hmm. of course, but kind of just vibing and shit like that. We do the ride out and things of that nature. But, uh, yeah, leave any comments. I don't know what I should hashtag it or something like that, but we... You know, three O podcast yeah, we'll uh, listeners and supporters are called. You know, it's like we yeah, kick like in, in the, in the treehouse. You know, tree yeah. one day the set will represent a treehouse, and I promise y'all. Yeah, we're will. working on that. Yeah, it's just it'll be it look different behind here at some point. Yeah, and it won't look like a treehouse, but, but it will, still, it'll, it'll be look clean. Different. It'll yeah. look, it'll look different. It'll be clean. Yeah. Um, but yeah, we'll get uh, into the ride out though. Um, I'm going with Encore. Okay. Nice. Um, Jay Z, just we all already know why. Yeah, yeah, we so, haven't heard. You like up on it. Yeah, you like to hear it? Here it go. When you first come in the game, they try and play you. Then you drop a couple of hits. Look how they weigh to you. Mm -hmm. From Marcy to Madison Square. So the only thing that matters is just a matter of years. Crazy album. I didn't even Insane Lincoln Park album. like with that was the first thing too. That was the first. Jay Z, out my mom bought for me. That was I think the first Jay Z, I'm gonna listen to. I went backwards. Yeah, that's me the first. too. I had to go backwards too. That was the yeah. first one that I was like, 
I'm buying this Jay Z album and I'm gonna like listen to it. Yeah, that yeah, is. Yeah. That is the same case for me and Sharon. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that was the first one we owned. First one, And bro. then we yeah. went backwards. <laughs> yeah. I experienced the a lot of hip-hop that way, though. I really did. Sometimes, yeah. I definitely experienced certain, a lot of like, hip-hop that way. Here's one, like the Biggie. I, yeah. I heard I heard the the those the mixtape they made where they remixed a bunch of his songs mm. and then I went backwards. From okay, the, okay. the Biggie duets, the Biggie duets. Uh, <laughs> Me too. Yes, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's and that one mixed it. That was an album. That was an it album. was an album. Yeah, yeah. wasn't it like just guest featured? Uh, all guest, yeah, featured. All but guest it, featured. It was, was Biggie versus two. Yeah. That's where Spit Your Game was on. Spit Your Game Crazy. was on that. all that yep. shit. Yep. Yeah, uh, that's the first. Uh, dead wrong? The f- was Dead wrong on that one? I don't think so. Oh, but it was featuring Eminem, wasn't it? Right, because they because technically I don't think they I don't think they recorded that together, right? No, no, no. A no, lot no, of those no. weren't recorded. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They right. were just, Eminem was not even a thing like when he was alive. That's what I thought. Yeah. Right. It was just a bunch of Lucy verses that they turned into full productions. Yeah. Crazy which always Eminem used to, verse. Which always used to confuse me because like when I, I went to, you know, on LimeWire to look for That's the song, right. I was like, featuring Eminem, wait, I, I'm confused. Like how, <laughs> you know, like how, yeah, how he how wasn't was alive. Dating? Yeah, right. When he was popping. <laughs> yeah. Sure. Oh, so, um, yeah. So uh, since we were talking about LL earlier, mm-hmm. I'm going to go with my favorite LL track. Um, it's called, if I'm not mistaken, because it's numbers, it's six, five, four, three, uh, two, one, I think. Yeah, I think that's what And it's, it's featuring Method Man, Red Man, DMX, Master P, and Cannabis. I, th- I think LL goes last, but fun, fun fact about the track. Um, that's what started their beef. Exactly. That's what yes, started. It is. Yes. That, that's what cannabis started. and uh, it's four three two one. I got it. Four three two one. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. Yep. Yeah, this so. is what. This is what. This is the official start. This is where. <laughs> this is where dissing a nigga on his own track was birthed. Yeah. Can- cannabis dissed him on his yeah. own track, and then like LL heard that, and then redid his track to yep. diss him on the same track. So this was the. <laughs> this was that first time in history that we got yeah. this. Yeah. yeah. So if you like to hear it, here you go. Had a phone number. Snatch this crown and if, yeah, oh, yeah. And the thing about these songs is, you know, they are five minutes a piece. Oh hell so. yeah, yeah. Oh, no, 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 no. You can't play the whole thing. Yeah. By the time you get to fucking LL, like it's already five minutes. Of right? Shit. Yeah, yeah. Because yeah. he's at the very end. Yeah. It's all just verses. <laughs> Which yeah, I mean, but, like content-wise, like I said, it was a lot less like written out on a piece of paper. It's probably like yeah. not that much. Niggas was filling notebooks up back in the day. Yeah, uh, but remember, it, remember that was a flex. How many? Yeah. Ri- how many? Okay, now in go- general, yeah, like yeah. how many rhyme books you went through? Yep. Yeah. Like yep. that was a flex back in the day, nigga. I had never finished a rhyme book. Little yeah. composition notebooks, like the composition notebooks. Yep, yeah. yeah. But it was so crazy, like how, like back in the music video days, like with BT and Rap CD and all that shit, you could put out a rap single and it have no hook and still get airplay. Oh, because that video in like ninety eight, ninety seven, ninety eight. They were like I can't sitting remember. around a table, right? Uh, no, like they, they were. Oh no, yes, they were. Yeah. yeah, yeah. At one point they were, but then they had like the different shots, different shots shit. for their scenes. Yeah, but yeah, so like that, and then I think Wu Tang's um song Triumph, like that song is just, just verses, straight bars. But yeah. but the video used to play on BET all the time. So, but yeah, so those those are crazy days. Yeah, that yeah. shit is crazy. Oh. Damn, I forgot he was here. You're right. <laughs> yeah, what's yours? Yeah, what's yours, Jeff? Uh, let's see. All right, you know what? Okay, I'm, I'm gonna do some. I'm gonna do some. Rest. Since we were talking about um. Some like rock rap shit that that, that yeah. that's nice, man. Do some. Yeah. How about uh, Bulls on Parade, man? Ooh, Rage. Yeah. Okay, all Rage right. Get some sheen. So yeah. we'll run that. It's classic, yeah. right? Oh my god, classic, yeah, right? Yeah, yeah. All right. Yo, I no lie. I'm sorry. I was just bumping <laughs> Testify when I was coming down Friday oh, from Charlotte. Nice. Oh, for real? Yeah, yeah. And nice. I've been bumping. I know these the white people out here think I'm crazy as hell because yeah. I've been bumping metal since I've been in Cary over at this region. <laughs> yeah. Then, I was playing the Renegades of Funk yeah. riding through Cary Town. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah see, that Rage, I'm, I'm like, really yeah. knowledgeable about, about their discography. Okay, more, more Rage. Red. Yeah. Okay. Rage is nice. Oh yeah, but yeah, yeah man. I mean, it's Rage like hey, you want to get you want to get like white boy pumped for a workout or some shit. This is it. Bulls on parade yeah. all, all day. Right. If you like to make you want to commit a crime, Go you gotta say to you like now. hey, y'all want to hear it? <laughs> yeah. hey, run that. <laughs> you did it smooth. And they're like a they're a political band, so they're all about Very, fuck the fuck the government. Yeah, mm-hmm. crazy, but so. but it's Rage so crazy. It's so ra- it's so crazy that you brought that up because just recently, like I did one of those li- a slice of life posts that I do with like footage from me and my brother when we were kids and all that shit and at the end I have like music videos 
um, one of the music videos was Bulls that, on Parade. Oh, yeah, shit. Yeah. That and I rem- insane. Yeah, and I reminded my brother, I was like, in the comments, I was like, hey, remember when we were kids, used to say, when, when that music video used to come, up, come on, used to say, rally around the family and a pocket full of shit? Oh, shit. <laughs> he was like, oh, yeah, I used to say that. When he was 10. Pocket full of shell. All right, pocket I got a... I got white man's ready. Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna switch it though, cause everybody doing some rock shit. Um, <laughs> everybody, everybody, I, I oh, just did some rock shit. I know, I know, but you know. it did bring one song back into my mind. Um, okay. Gym class heroes, Viva La oh, White Girl. Yeah. Okay. And it's yeah. not quite the same type of record at mm-hmm. all, mm-hmm. but it just made me think about some shit that had some influence from a different side that I really took to when I was younger. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. And gym class heroes definitely did that. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? With close off and all the other records. Yep. But yeah. uh. This one, Viva La White Girl, the remix had Lil Wayne on it, I believe. Mm. Oh um, yeah, it did. Mm-hmm. And uh, we could play either version. Mm-hmm. I just, I just love this record all together. Yeah, know. I remember that track. The Fame, fortune. That's the one. Plot. The remix doesn't have Lil, the Apple Music or whatever. It doesn't have the, the Lil, Lil Wayne, Wayne version. That's uh-huh. fine. That, so if you want fine. the Lil Wayne, okay. one, I was, can we run the music video? Yeah, put it on the music because the Lil Wayne one. Did he do the video? I think he was in the video. Maybe it was a video. Wait, this, single. is this the one where they were in the they were in the school gym? Okay. With all the people in it, or, or am I thinking of um, gr- a girlfriend? You're thinking of girlfriend. Okay. Yeah, this is the remix right here. Oh, that was Fall Out Boy. And that, that, the lead singer, take a look at my girlfriend. All right, if you like to hear oh, it. Oh, that was that. I was trying to remember how it went, but then when the Lil Wayne part came, I was like, I remember Yippee that. Yeah, I remember that. Yeah, I, I thought that voice. was just on a mixtape. It might have been. That was on one of those like I think Carter, so. It's yeah, not or official. Not Carter, yeah, um, remakes. It. That was on a drought tape or something. Yeah. yeah Giddy so up as the white stallion bucks. Crazy first. <laughs> Kicks me in my nose. <laughs> <laughs> These niggas yeah, had a crazy. whole song dedicated to Coke, bro. That was, was crazy. Fire, bro. Yeah. If there was any every re- a record that made you want to try some shit, <laughs> that, <laughs> that, that song makes you want to do Coke. For yeah, sure. no, I agree. <laughs> they were good at that back in the day. NERD had a few tracks like that. They yeah. did. Like Am I High? But like, yeah, that kind of made we me want to try are... something. We are those in a glamorous <laughs> white girl, so fine. Dang it. Yeah, niggas love cocaine, boy. I yeah, swear. Right. <laughs> All right, I got F Max too. Yeah. Um. Yeah. Mine was. Uh. Mine was. I for, I'm forgetting what I sent you. Just <laughs> you sent me a more. Oh no, armor, armor, armor. by um, AJ Radico. Yeah. Just yeah. want to bring um, some new age blacks right now. This is okay. a workout song for sure. Okay, mm. okay, so, say okay. less. You want to hear? Here, go. Yeah. That was fire. Yeah, yeah, that's his art. Especially that second verse. <laughs> What's his name again? Cause that's was that a feature? Um, no, that's his song. That's, that's AJ Radico. That's still him. Mm-hmm. Okay, that's AJ Radico. Yeah, that's the type that of record that made me want to go down his catalog list. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> and that project looked like it came out on a project called Transit. Yeah, that whole project actually from 20, was pretty good from 2021. That's probably the first one though, because I'll remember that. Cover. Yeah, because you'll remember yeah. that one. Yeah, mm-hmm. so that came out in 2021. Yeah. Oh, no, I took that back. 2019. Oh, oh. wow. And so, yeah, his yeah. singles are good, too. He's he's good. Mm, okay. I'm going to look into him. And the beat was crazy, too. The beat was hard. Yeah. yeah, yeah, that shit was hard. But all right, y'all. Um, That's everything for the 3 Podcast. Make sure you like, comment, share, subscribe, everything to 3 Podcast. Message material entertainment in itself. You know, even if you have one show that you favor over the other, it always helps us that you hit the like button, <laughs> drop a comment, even if you don't watch it, even if it's not your show. You know what I mean? Yeah, that's right. So, so help support the entire channel, but, you yeah. know, definitely show love on your favorite show. Yeah. But, yeah, man, that's everything. Uh, make sure you follow us, and we'll see y'all niggas next week. All right. Peace. Peace. So.